right. Welcome back. Woo. Nine points between the moralities. Nine points. The renegades are catching up. Oh, it's good to see you all. Thank you for being here. It's another day on the Normandy. Another day in Mass Effect. Oh, shit. Nasaka, what's going on? Throw it around. Don't worry about it. Never worry about it. If you're here, you're here. If you're not, not stressed. It's all good. It's good to see you, Nasaka. I hope you've been well. Nachos Brohim, gifting a sub to Saiyan Fox. Bumping up Renegade score by one. Saiyan Fox, happy 11 months. Pitsy, thanks for the host. Feel bad going Renegade, but you're full Paragon on your run, yeah? Okay, we're gonna go quickly run around the ship, talk to everybody now that we're done with the Bring Down the Sky DLC. We'll go have a little wander. Does yours not pop, Blazer? Your Renegade? Your, your Renegade one, it did. Commander, something you need? I have to go. Yeah, it went off, Blazer said you gossiped about the character that we haven't seen yet. Which I, I didn't realize when I put a lot of these in that they were characters we hadn't seen yet, but that's fine. Didn't see it on yours, Blazer? Yeah, no, it definitely popped, man. How are you, dude? Shadow Wraith, good morning. Raterakin, good morning. Ooh! Mecha Menu! Jesus fucking Christ, bringing in Call the Barbarian, Timmy Boy, Didact, Knight of the Wolf, and Brandon Mermtrue. Mm, true. Jesus fucking Christ. Mecha menu. Good Lord. Thanks for the five pack. No relation. No relation whatsoever. Where's it going? Thank you so much. Cheeky fucking five pack to kick us off for the day. Renegade. All right, let me add that shit. Oh. <laughs> the scores are tied. Didact, what's up, man? Shepard is true neutral. Never mind. Never mind. get the feeling you want to ask me something, Commander. Oh! Oh! <laughs> oh, shit! Blazer! Cheeky two-pack! Payman! Cheeky two-pack! Pal Wolf, Canuck, Seri Pieri, and serve him. Live for the chaos. They're both going renegade? Score check, please. I just wanted to talk. Of course, Shepard. What did you want to talk about? I should go. Goodbye, Shepard. The renegades are in the lead. The renegades have taken control. And so everything changes. Payment, Blazer, Menu, Nachos. Mwah. Thank you so Anything much. Anything you need, Commander? Just trying to get a sense of where the crew's at. Thoughts? I've wasted enough of your time for now, Commander. We'll right. talk another time, Lieutenant. Commander? Fair enough. Plotted into Paragon. <laughs> well, it seems like we don't have anyone else. To, it's like if no one else has got new dialogue for us. Unreal.
about renegades? You wanted it? You got it. Go to the strenuous system. Um, Zawin. I think we already went here, right? This will go on trailing. Yeah, we've been here. To the pack system. Svarog. Morana. Veles. Atriox writings. Lovely. To Novaria. Approach control. This is the SSV Normandy requesting a vector and a berth. Normandy, your arrival was not scheduled. Our defense grid is armed and tracking you. State your business. Citadel business. We got a council specter aboard. Landing access granted, Normandy. Be advised, we will be confirming identification on arrival. If confirmation cannot be established, your vessel will be impounded. What a fun bunch. I think I'll take my next leave here. It's renegade time. You're gonna try and confirm who Shepard is? Do you know who I am? <coughs> we got a Spectre on board. Welcome to Novaria. Okay, Liara. Garrus. Liara Garrus. Oop. Equalizing interior pressure with exterior atmosphere. Let's go. The commanding officer is ashore. Exo Presley has the deck. All right. Security drone. Chest high walls. Brilliant. There's a few Simmons, few few actors you might recognize. Keith David. That's far enough. Renegade. I'm on important business. This is an unscheduled arrival. I need your credentials. You first. We're the law here. Show some respect. I'm Captain Maiko Matsuo, Ilanis Risk Control Services. I outrank you. All you need to know is I have more credentials than you. They plan to be trouble, man. I can't let you enter the port area without confirmation of your identity. Sergeant Sterling, secure their weapons. Citadel authority supersedes yours. Nobody takes my weapon. Charge and lock! We are authorized to use lethal force. You have to the count of three to surrender your weapons. One, two, three. Captain Matsuo, stand down! We confirmed their identity. Spectres are authorized to carry weapons here, Captain. You may proceed, Spectre. I hope the rest of your visit will be less confrontational. Parasini-san will meet you upstairs. Behave yourself. Fuck yourself. Get out of here. Whoa. I'm sure Parasini-san will answer any questions you have. Noveria, huh? It was about to go down. Oh. I am Gianna Parasini, assistant to Administrator Analeas. We apologize for the incident in the docking bay. Someone piss in your security chief's coffee today? She takes her job seriously. She is a valuable asset to the company. One of my duties is orientation of new arrivals. Do you have any questions? Has anyone unusual passed through here recently? Unusual? 
And a sorry matriarch passed through a few days ago. Lady Benezia. Bingo. Benezia. She is here? She's a threat to galactic peace. I'm here to bring her in or put her down. The board doesn't like having outside problems dumped in its lap, Commander. Benezia left for the Peak 15 research complex days ago. To the best of my knowledge, she's still there. Good. Give us directions and we'll be on our way. You'll need to ask Administrator Analeas for clearance to leave this port. Pretty heavy security for such a small port. The Executive Board does everything in its power to protect the privacy of our client corporations. Is this privacy intended to hide illegal research? This planet is beyond the jurisdiction of the Citadel. The law is what the Executive Board says it is. Do you know how valuable this planet is? How many advances in genetics and artificial intelligence got their start here? Where can I find the Administrator? His office is on the main level, left at the top of the elevator. All right. Understood. Who's Bishop? Bishop is the uh, cyborg. Of course. If you need any help, you can ask me at the Administrator's office. And Hackett is... She's um. Here. I can't believe it. Holy Ara. I imagine you want to talk to me, Shepard. About my mother. Don't worry. I trust you. No, we don't. I trust you, Liara. You may not be military, but you're a part of my crew. Thank you, Shepard. That means a great deal to me. Little kiss, 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 kiss. Um, Admiral Hackett is just an, uh, an admiral for the uh, the human uh, human navy, basically. Welcome to Port Hanshan, the galaxy's most respected site for independent scientific research and development. For your own safety, and to protect the privacy of others, you are required to obey any directions given by our security personnel. If you have questions or concerns, our friendly administrative staff is always available. Thank you, and enjoy your stay. Boomy goddamn Diyata, 39 months. Marvelous. Sound like blathers from Animal Crossing. Marvelous. Thank you so much, Boomy. How you doing, man? Hmm. The managers warned us about you. Hello there. This one offers greetings. You are the specter that visits Port Hanchan. You heard already. Travels fast here. Indeed, esteemed specter, your arrival was not greeted with any joy by the companies here. I imagine not. This one has a burden that you could ease. If an arrangement could be made, it would compensate you. This one has procured a special item for a customer. The item is not permitted within the station, but you could bring it through customs. Smuggling, in other words. I'm here to shop. Maybe later. Right now, I need supplies. Of course. This one apologizes for inconveniencing you. Good. Uh, view upgrades. Ah, he has none. Has the other reconsidered this one's plea for aid? Oh, the renegade option is to do it. All right, I'll help. This one humbly thanks the specter. The package will be delivered to your vessel. All you need do is bring it to this one. Please do not mention this to Administrator Analeas. That one would levy fees. Renegades in the lead, eh, Pop? Is there anything else this one might help you with? Could I buy something now? <laughs> is there anything in particular the Spectre is looking for? Space of Thieves. Pirates now. All right. Uh, Rosenkopf Materials License. Yes. Oh, that is better than what I've got. Um... And it's better for Liara too. Let's buy... Shields aren't as good as what Liara's got. But the protection is slightly better. Assault rifle? Can't afford it. God, that's a good assault rifle though. Sell all junk. Let's... Let's... Check what I've got. See what I can sell. I 
think I'm rocking the best shit that I can. Uh, uh, uh. I just bought that. Slightly better protection. Okay, Liara. I think everyone's got the... Oh, hang on. Oh, hang on. The Raikou. Naginata. The Savant. Yeah. What everyone feeling is appropriate given the situation. Apox is sneaky, man. You never know what he's going to do. Okay, Garrus. G'day, Mushy. Apoc the Puppeteer. Playing in the shadows. Katana, Scimitar, Hurricane. Good. Raikou. Put the Raikou six. It's about as good as it's gonna get, I think. The Hammer six. Oh, the Naginata four is much better. In pretty much every way. All right. Greetings. Well, sell. Have you brought the package? I want to buy I'm something. Here to shop. We can discuss of course. This sell. I don't want to sell the upgrades, just the weapons. Weapon upgrade, grenade upgrade, pistol, pistol, armor, armor, shotgun. I'm assuming I can't sell things I'm holding. I'm just going to take that as a... If I can, we're in, we might be in trouble, but I can reload a save. Weapon upgrades. God, it's a lot of weapon upgrades. Omni-tool. Omni-tool. Wow, look at the cash. Look at the cash. I'll buy that. Thank you very much. Assault rifle. Oh, oh shit. Rail extension. Recoil damper. Holy fucking Jesus, that's a good rifle. And then I'm going to give Garrus 
the tsunami. Give Liara the raptor. And let's go back through and check all the upgrades. Incendiary rounds five. Drops accuracy a little bit. Shield bypass is nice. Tungsten rounds versus synthetics is pretty nice. Oh, man. Have an appointment in a few. Silent, no worries. Back in about an hour. No worries. We'll see you then. I think I'm able to play Mass Effect when you do, but I need to be so on the ball with modding. Oh, APOC. You know what, man? Like, it's cool. I think we've got a couple of mods here. You can play. Um, I'll keep that. Stabilizer. More damage. Heat absorption. Okay, that's fine. Working now? Oh, okay. Steve! Kinetic stabilizer. Good to have. High explosive one. Oh, we've got high explosive four. Medical interface. Whoa. Yeah, we'll keep that. Okay, Liara. Cryo rounds five. I'm going to give Liara tungsten round. Kinetic stabilizer. Polonium. The rail extension. Hardened wave three. Shield recovery. Garrus. I don't know if combat sensor does anything for teammates. Beautiful. Stack that up. Armor piercing rounds two. Cryo rounds. Phasic rounds. Incendiary. The rail extension. Anti personnel rounds. Shield bypass. With a heat sink. Then what's this one? Stimulant pack. Cooldown reduction. Shields. 110% shields. What the fuck did I put on you? Shield recovery. 110. Oh! Shields all round! All right. Greetings, Spectre. Have you brought the package? I'm here to shop. We can discuss this later. Now we sell all the mods. Of course. This one apologizes for inconveniencing you. APOC. Gift and a sub to Bubba TC. That's a rare occasion. Bubba, you've been conscripted, mate. Happy 15 months. APOC, where's it going? Thanks, APOC. Mwah. Smooches. Fucking smoochy booches to you. Bloody legend Paragon. All right. Done. Renegades are up by one point. One point the difference. (laughs) 
Mode only for two minutes. All right. You wanted it. You got it. Hundred percent shields. Twenty four percent shield recovery. Combat scanner, combat scanner. Not bad, man. Not bad. Increases the number of grenades carried. That does seem pretty good. How much is it? Oh. Yeah. It's completely tied up. Houses. Well, we already agreed to, to smuggle this item in for this guy when we were renegades. Let's go and smuggle this item for him. New tactic, lock the Paragon and Renegade Editions. Backbone, I hope you're doing well, by the way. <laughs> Purple. <laughs> there it is, two minutes. I'll be keeping my eye on you. Was that longer than two minutes? Fuck, it went quick. Opold's package. Grab that, go return it to Opold. So, so far, renegades have managed to kill a bunch of hostages and smuggle a package. We're a little bit paragade, really. Definitely leaning further to the paragon side, but the occasional renegade slip through is like, oh shit, what's Shepard doing? I still haven't included a, uh, a cooldown timer. What I wanted to include was a cooldown timer. So if you use the command and the cooldown was um, was still on, it would whisper you how much time you had left. But I still haven't set that up. I will though, I promise. Sorry, I haven't got to it yet. Greetings, Spectre. Have you brought the package? Lie, I haven't picked it up. Yes, I have. Here you are. The Spectre has done a great service for this one. From the deepness of light, it thanks you. This one promised compensation for services rendered. It humbly suggests that a sum of 250, 250 credits, credits would be most appropriate. Are we Paragon or Renegade? It's tied up. Uh, you know what, Renegades? You got us into this mess. You'll get us You're out. Trying to make me laugh. You think I'm here to amuse you? To make funny sputtering noises when you offer an insult instead of a reward? Our Renegades are leading. Never mind then. No. This one would never. This one could raise the sum to five hundred. Spence credits. is killing me. That is half this one's profit taken by the other. It can offer no more. It'll have to do. If that's the best you can do, fine. This one is glad to have come to an agreement. So we got... I'm just browsing right now. We got this a fucking top return. tier assault rifle. Look at this thing. Top tier dirty assault rifle.
Uh, before we go speak to Analeas. Whoops, Daisy. We played the human card. Yeah. We're the victim. We're the victim here. Before we go speak to the guy we've got to speak to, let's just go for a little poke around. See what we can find. It's a synthetic insight. <laughs> Lily Hyrax. Spectre, right? Who's asking? Don't worry. I'm not out to put a slug in your head. I used to be a military tech. Except for my ego's people, everyone's too corporate here. They just sit around sipping expensive water. So what can I do for you today? You seem like you have an ear to the ground. What's happening around here? There's the problems up on Peak 15. Synthetics Insights was shut down by Analeas. And a matriarch came through. Uh, matriarch. Do you know where that matriarch is now? You looking for her? She took a shuttle to Peak 15 before we lost contact. What sort of problems are there at Peak 15? Don't know. There's a blizzard up there, but we've had those before. Never cut the satellite uplinks before. 15's always had a lousy reputation. Nobody talks about what they do there. And everyone sent up comes back a little quiet. There's something fucked going on at peak 15. What was that about synthetic insights? Scuttlebutt says Laura Keen was on the take. Zainalea shut down SI's offices. Quiet like, so no off-world lawyers come in on it. Just wondering why my chroma key was fucking up in that corner. It was just my vape. What do you do here? I'm the chief mechanic for Hanshan. Just call me Lee. Humans have a problem saying my full name. Got a team of 12 under me, keeping the shuttles coming and going. You know what I might do, actually? Turn on the fan, get some airflow going up in here. It's so vapey in here. Uh, Warblazer! Thanks for the gift sub to EA. <laughs> Putting a point into Renegade. EA. <laughs> they can afford their own sub. <laughs> Thank you, Blazer. <laughs> How can I get into the garage? Turn down the wattage? No, it's pass. still at 50. You can get one from Analeas for the managers. If you can polish enough gizzard. You have one, right? Maybe you could let me borrow yours? Sure. If I wanted to lose my job and get sued into the next spiral arm, security tracks card use. I was looking through people I knew that would actually want a sub, but they all fucking have one. <laughs> uh, all right. I have to go. I have to go. You need anything? I'll be here. Thanks, Lee. Access to the garage is restricted. Stand aside. I'm on Citadel business. I need to leave this station. Polish enough gizzard, yeah. If you want to enter the garage, you need authorization for Mr. Analeas. No exceptions. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> A gizzard? <laughs> Oops. Blazer! Give the sub to Zepepi. And your Cody sub ran out. <laughs> or he changed it. Fuck. <laughs> Blazer. Thank you for the gift sub to Zepepi. You fucking legend. Is that a uh, renegade? <laughs> Thank you, Blazer. It would be beautiful. Done and done. <laughs> now I'm I'm just gonna go masturbate. Like a lot. Vigorously. Like vigorously. Yeah. Thanks, man. Red Planet, good morning, mate. How are you doing? How are you doing? That was a weird weird emphasis on that one. The renegades are in the lead. 
When Rev is away, the Renegades shall play. It's good to see you, Red. Tanbar's pretty good, huh? Fixed it. Blazes on it. <laughs> We're Renegade just in time to explore Noveria. Excuse me. I need a moment of your time. The male human at the hotel bar? He's a sales rep for Binary Helix. His name is Raphael Vargas. I need you to speak with him. Whatever you need done, ask someone else. I'm busy. My mistake, obviously. Oh, hang on. All right. Have you changed your mind? Would you speak to Vargas for me? Strange people skulking in corners have gotten me in trouble before. I represent the Aramali City Council on Thessia. Our town is known for its biotic amp crafters. What is your city's interest in binary helix? They do not manufacture amps. Much of BH's work relates to biotics. There are rumors that the Novaria branch has flown in Asari biotics. Powerful ones. Commandos, to be specific. Mm. We want to assess any potential risk to Asari copyrights. Fair enough. You will present yourself as a buyer, on behalf of the Spectres or the Alliance. Discuss their military enhancement programs. Your real objective will be to distract him. I will give you a device that will crack into his personal wireless network. Mm. It will upload a variety of monitoring viruses. They will infiltrate Binary Helix when he logs onto their intranet. What do I get out What's of this? What's in it for me? Money, of course. I would be well paid for this. So would you. 500 credits. 500 credits is fuck all. Plan? I'm in. Excellent. Here is the cracking device. You will know it is done when it beeps. I have assembled a dossier on Vargas. If you would like, I could brief you on his behavior brief me. patterns. Tell me what you know about Vargas. He is impatient with those who waste his time. I tried to get him distracted and off topic. He concluded I was not interested in his company's services. I noticed he has a tell. When a topic makes him nervous or uncomfortable, he has a tendency to rub the back of his neck. Okay. If you see that, press him on the subject. It may distract him enough to keep him talking. I'll go see okay, him now. Okay, so stay, go and be straight to business. Talk about his business. And then, um... What sort of offer? Good. Oh, oh there he is. He rubs his neck. Press him. Can I help you? I'm a specter. Mr. Vargas, I'm Commander Shepard, a specter. I understand you work for Binary Helix. That's correct. Raphael Vargas sales. The Phoenix Rod. Were you interested in our services? If the price is right? I might be. That depends on what sort of offer your company can make. It was my understanding that the Citadel contracted to a Solarian Corporation for its enhancement programs. That's irrelevant. Are we, are we renegade? We're renegade. Mr. Vargas, I'm here to talk business with you. If you'd rather speculate on politics, I can visit another Gen Eng firm. You have my full attention, Shepard. I'm merely getting a handle on my negotiating position. First, the boilerplate disclaimer. No genetic enhancement is guaranteed to take. We can maximize the odds, but every strand of DNA is unique. Our patented techniques can provide an 8% improvement in adrenal response, 12% faster clotting, and a measurable decrease in CG muscle degeneracy. Mars Gene's clotting enhancement improves speed by 16%. Ah, I see you've done some research. That's their official claim. However, we believe they cherry-picked their sample to show optimum results. The numbers we provide are strict mathematical averages. Okay. I can get you those improvements for 30k credits per head. For a bulk order, I can work on a sensory enhancement package, guaranteed 2015 vision and hearing from 12 to 22,000 hertz. Are you sure that's the best price you can offer? Absolutely. That's the standard rate. Of course, if the government moves forward with this on an official level, there might be some additional discounts. I have to admit, it surprised me that you were here for business. There are many development projects on Avaria, some not entirely. I wear a lot of hats, Mr. Vargas. Some days I shut down criminals, some days I defuse nukes, some days I like to enjoy private vices. You understand me? I suppose. My apologies. Your manner is rather informal for a business meeting. <coughs> Sounds like my crew needs me for something. I'll be in Did we touch. get what we need? Of course, Commander Shepard. We look forward to doing business with the Citadel. Yeah, we won't be doing business with the Citadel. At all. Any results? 
Uh, it's done. Your toy did its job. Excellent. I will transfer 500 credits to your account. More. I could easily call Mr. Vargas and tell him what I just did. Did I say 500 credits? I meant 750. Oh, you meant 750? Yeah, that's a little Good bit more day, like Spectre. it. That's a little bit more like it. Thank you very much. Number from Norway. How you doing, mate? Hello? Afternoon. Nachos. Sit down. Have Look a at drink. the scores, mate. What can I do for you? I need to get up to peak 15. Indeed. That might be difficult. A terrible storm has been unleashed up there. Are you referring to the blizzard? Of course. What else would I be referring Absolutely to? Absolutely we did, APOC. Don't play me. There was an accident. Your manner may be too blunt for Novaria. This is a place of subtlety. Is it? There have been unseemly rumors circulating along the lines of ancient evil and plague from distant suns. <laughs> Amusing, no? Someone watches too many bad horror vids. Who might you be? Loric Keen. For the moment, I am the manager of the Synthetic Insights office. Having some trouble with your office? Mr. Analeas closed my You're office. You're all good, Apoch. You're all good. To be investigating reports of my corruption. It's going well, Number. The administrator is an interesting man. He's become quite wealthy since he took direct control of rents. Skip to the part where you tell me what you want and what you'll give me for it. Renegade. Put bluntly, the administrator demands rent kickbacks from the companies on Novaria. I acquired evidence of Analeas' actions. His hired goons are ransacking my office to find it. Hmm. I suspect your goal lies outside this port. Mr. Analeas would be disinclined to let you wander. If you recover the evidence from my office, I will give you my garage pass, as well as a sum of credits. Sounds good. That sounds like a fair trade. Violence against Mr. Analeas' thugs may be necessary. He has members of Han Shan's security team searching my offices. He's paying them under the table. Miss Matsuo is unaware of their outside employment. They're crooked. He's paying them under the table. They're mercenaries. I can kill mercenaries. Excellent. Here is my pass into our offices. It will activate the elevator. The evidence is on my office computer. This OSD contains an encryption key to access it. Slide it into the drive and it will auto-execute. Oh, and do try to keep blood stains off the carpets, would you? The blood stains on the carpet. Cool. Progress. Oopsie Daisy. Sathy, how are you doing, by the way? Good to see you. There's nothing down here. Nothing out here either. One more little look. One more little squidgery didge up there. See if there's anything worth looking at. Doorman. I'm sorry. The hotel is off limits to those without a corporate account. Oh, fair enough. Juju. Slipping in a paragon. Don't hang up. Elder brother? It's me. I'm on the barrier now. I can't talk long. In a so mortar. It's real time, Mr. Read it. Sorry. Just hack into this little vending machine. Here, don't mind if I do? Synthetic inside security disabled. Oh, I could have just got in there. I said beat it. Did you now? Go find something else to do, stupid mammal. Sorry, what was that? If you don't stop poking me, I'll throw you off that balcony. Okay. I thought maybe he'd pick a fight. <laughs> I 
No worries, Gino. All good. Very important. Krogan in a small hallway. Save. Yeah. Yeah, I'm not risking that. Krogan in a small hallway where there is a drop next to us. I think I'll wait. Okay, synthetic insights. This way. Let's go help out our boy, Lorik. I should go, everyone. I should go. Oh, hello. Freeze. Henshan security. This office is sealed. What do you do if I don't? You're the Spectre, right? Laura Keen is under investigation. Analeas is paying you to shake this place down. That makes you a criminal. I can kill criminals. You're bluffing. Everything the commander has said is true. I'd step aside if I were you. He ain't paying me enough to take on Spectres or Alliance troops or whatever. How about this? You pretend you didn't see us, we'll pretend we didn't see you. I like that plan. Two less. Where's all my fucking... Okay. Throw. Warp. Shield boost. Barrier. Unity. Throw. That makes you a criminal. I kill criminals. Fucking smooth, Shepard. in here technician kit medical kit wall safe don't mind if I do thank you very much Yeah, that, that, that wasn't a good look, was it, that I was shooting at the Turian because <laughs> I didn't know if it was Garrus or the enemy. <laughs> look, they can be a little hard to tell apart sometimes, that's all. They're wearing similar armor, you know. You download the evidence from Lorik's computer. And... We have friends. Hello. Oh, Kaira. We're acquainted. I don't think you're supposed to be in here, Shepard. Do you plan on making me leave? Leave? You think I'm gonna let you walk out? Uh-uh. Analeas would throw you off world for what you did here. I won't. You know what we did to cop killers on my world? Your men are dirty, Sergeant. You're here off-duty, breaking the law for bribe money. If you want to fight, I'll give you one. Renegade. You talk the talk. Let's see if you can walk after I break your legs. Oh.
Jesus. Okay, let's uh, let's do that again, shall we? <laughs> let's 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 do that again, shall we? Analyze. Your men are dirty. You talk the talk. Let's see if you can walk after I break your legs. You got rockets? Get the fuck out of here. Dude, this, this new rifle's so good! She's down. <laughs> we got her. God, the grenades are good. Good morning, Gakarov. Oh, yeah. Then finish this guy off, shall we? I lost? Wait a minute, that's not in the script. <laughs> All right. Had Maccas for lunch. The burger patties and the sandwiches are shrinking. Oh, man. Of course they are. Doesn't make me want to get it any less, though. All right. Commander, oh. there have been reports of noise from the Synthetic Insights office. Would you know anything about it? Of course not. Why would I? Don't play me, Shepard. Meet me at the hotel for a drink before you talk to Keen. I'll be waiting. Okay. She's the assistant to the cunt that we just got evidence on. And she wants to talk before we give the evidence back to the guy. Suspicious much? Well, we've got guns. We can handle it. Seems kind of sus, just a little bit. God, this new rifle's so good, man. I'm so pleased. There she is. Gianna Parasini. Allow me to reintroduce myself. Parasini, Novaria Internal Affairs. Ooh, she's a space cop. What do you want? The executive board knows about Analeas's corruption. I've been undercover for six months. I want you to convince Keen to testify before the board. With his evidence, this planet can run profitably again. Are we Renegon? Re a renegade? You work for Analeas. Can't you just take his records? <laughs> He's a crook, not a moron. He doesn't keep logs on his computer saying, This month I stole three million credits. Keen's testimony and records are everything I need to prove Analeas' guilt in one package. Why don't you ask Keen directly? I'm Analeas' secretary. You think he'd believe me? That he'd meet me in some dark alley with his evidence? I thought corruption was the rule on Novaria. The rule is don't rock the boat. 
Self-interest is tolerated if it doesn't interfere with business. Analeas is driving customers away. If your executive board loses a few million credits, it's not my problem. I have my own mission. Yes, yes, fate of billions and all that. I couldn't possibly understand how important your work is. You help my investigation, I'll provide whatever you need. Favor for a favor. Analeas is dirty. It might be best to help her. Look, Shepard, I don't like this either. You specters play fast and loose with the law. That's bad for business. Keen is offering to pay me. Can you? I can produce a copy of Analeas's pass for you. I can't move large sums of money without someone noticing. I'll consider it and get back to you. If you pay have me. any love for the law, you'll talk to Keen for me. Don't disappoint me. You know where I work. Come talk to me when you change your mind. All right. I reckon we can talk him into it. I love that that option. Pay me. Always a pleasure, Spectre. Any news on that matter I asked you to look into? I finished the job, but an internal affairs investigator contacted me. She wants you to testify against Enelaus. Now that you have my property, you want to dictate how I use it. I have no interest in a public spectacle. If necessary, yes. Do what I tell you to, or Analeas will find what he's looking for. It is good to have all our cards on the table. I regret that you have a better hand. Very well, I will testify. Renegade plus Make 25. G'day, Jin Rummy. How are you, mate? Yeah, Renegade's catching up. Paragon's almost halfway. Renegade's about a third. That was a big one. Uh, oh, hang on. I'm just going to play this codex while I go piss. Novaria is a cool, rocky world with most of its hydrosphere locked up in massive glaciers. A privately chartered colony world, the planet is owned by the Novaria Development Corporation Holding Company. The NDC is funded by investment capital from two dozen high technology development firms and administrated by an executive board representing their interests. The investors built remote hot labs in isolated locations across Novaria's surface. These facilities are used for research too dangerous or controversial to be performed elsewhere, as Novaria is technically not part of Citadel space and therefore exempt from council law. By special arrangement, Citadel special tactics and reconnaissance agents have been granted extraterritorial privileges, but it remains to be seen how committed the executive board is to that principle. Given its unique situation, it is understandable that Novaria is often implicated in all manner of wild conspiracy theories. Just a quick one. Beautiful. Ugh. Can you hover over the icon and press... What icon? They're cute, by the way, nachos. The, the new housemates. And the selecting of skills. Or you mean... You mean this? auto add them instead of dragging them now it uses them regroup yeah i don't know why it keeps forgetting my um my quick bar Blue and Echo. Oh, they're really cute. Have you put them in Discord yet? In the pet pals? They're real sweet.
Lethal, how could you? All right. Analeas' office. Spectre, have you given any more consideration to my offer? It took some persuasion, but Keen has agreed to testify. <sighs> That's a world of stress off my back. I'll take the evidence for safe transport. <laughs> I didn't think you'd help me, being a Spectre and all. I guess some of you can be all right. That's some gratitude you got there. Sorry, I'm used to having my guard up. When people find out I'm internal affairs, they treat me like a traitor. While you were working on Keen, I got you a garage pass. Beautiful. Be careful up there. I have an arrest to make. Wish I had time to change into something easy to move in. I hate skirts. This is an outrage. I'll see that you never work in this sector again. Yeah, yeah, get a move on. You, Shepard! I demand you place this bitch under arrest! You have the right to remain silent. I wish to God you'd exercise it. See you around the galaxy, Commander. I owe you a beer. There's one thing we missed out on here, and that was actually talking to Analeas before he got arrested for, for a, you know, stealing funds, basically. Um, but he's a prick. You talk to him, and he's just a fucking asshole to Shepard. Shepard's like, hey, I need your help. And he's like, yeah, well, I need a lot of things too. Fuck you. He absolutely deserved to get arrested. Like, y'all didn't get the, you know, the context of it all, but he's really fucking rude to Shepard. And it doesn't matter how nice you are or how rude you are, or even if you align with his interests, he's a cunt. So it's really satisfying to see him get arrested. Sorry, I, um, I forgot that I was supposed to talk to him first to get that full context, but... You all saw all you needed to see. He was breaking the law. He was smuggling funds. That's... <coughs> oh, fuck. I just inhaled a piece of mint. Oh, God. Right in the throat hole. Pow, right in the throat hole. All right, we got a garage pass. Now we can go up to peak 15 and check in with Matriarch Benezia, who is also working with Saren, who is also the Ara's mum. So, yeah. That ought to be good. Access to the garage is restricted. I have authorization. Excuse me. Yes, that's genuine. Drive safely. The yes, that's genuine. Pretty bad out in the Alutsk Valley. I'm going to save again, just so I don't have to have that conversation again. Brilliant. I see these are what the matriarch had in the crates. Thanks, Garrus. Oh, good of you to show up now, Matsuo. 
What did you do here, Commander? Just business? Only what I had to. I didn't ask the Geth to attack. Geth, you expect me to... Where did they come from? If I were to guess, the Matriarch packed them in the shipping container she arrived with. I don't believe that. We did thorough scans of those. There were no power sources, no element zero masses. If Benezia Sama's containers were packed with these things, there are many more out there. Oh, gr brilliant. Good. Finn, what is that? So much for the golden future, I can't even start. What song is that? Why do I know that? I'm, s I, I'm singing a song in my head and I can't fucking pick what it is. It's not Sabbath. What the fuck is it? I'm singing it in my head and yet I can't verbalize it. Breaking the law, Judas Priest. So much for the golden future. I can't even start. There we go. I, I, I was singing it in my head and I couldn't fucking get it out. And I fucking knew I knew what it was. We may be seeing a lot more of these things in the coming months. For three centuries, everyone has said the Geth don't come out of the veil. What is happening out there? I must report to the executive board. If word gets out about loose Geth, there may be an investor panic. Wow, the renegades have really taken a lead today. Hot dog. Yeah, Golden Dragon, they come running. The Geth are fucking scary. And that's why Insanity in Mass Effect 1 was such a cunt. Because, um... The combat was really sticky and clunky and the Geth would do that. They just run up to you. Same with Krogan. Krogan do the same fucking thing. They just sprint at your face and you can't do anything about it. So you got to rely on, I rely on biotics. <laughs> Holy fuck, roasted donut, bringing in Ender, Zintax, Om Omar, Twisted, Desia, CSC Monster, Uth Ulthada, Jek One, Mass Defect, Guiltless Gaming, Queen Katoma, Killed a Chat. <laughs> Uh, Mr. Shishu, Mantis, Psycho Wolf, Bran, Marek, Eno, Dev, J. Lotus, Oblivious, Oda, Cat and Cake Tin. God damn, Roasted Donut. Thanks for the fucking 20 pack, mate. 20 more to Renegade. Oh my God. Well then. Renegades. Your hero is awoken. Jesus fucking Christ, Roasted. Let's go. Thank you, man. Fuck. Rise of the Renegades. God damn. Just like the Phoenix. We'll fucking rise again. I can see you smiling. Womp, 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 womp. Glad this is still here. Save. Let's go. Also, that um, that garage bay fight that we just did with the Geth is pretty infamous. It's rough. Like that is kind of an infamous fight for being an absolute cunt.
You lost three hours? Fuck. Get the are a little Necron, yeah. Definitely some similarities. Did an auto save, yeah. I'm on my Wii. Minus the whole god enslaving thing of the Necrons, yeah. God killing. I got Maccas and I blame whoever talked about it. <laughs> blame Red. Do more jerky tomorrow. Nicely, nice. Bloody Mass Effect on the Wii. <laughs> I'm on my Wii. <laughs> Dude, this is fucking beautiful. Just side note. <laughs> Maybe I'll get Mackies today too. Damn it, Red. <laughs> Roasted, thanks again for the fucking 20 pack, dude. That's unreal. Thank you, everyone who's gifted subs and everyone who's uh, watching the goddamn show right now. A little, a little precursor, a little, little, little friendly reminder. You don't have to spend a cent to enjoy this stream, be a part of this community, even affect the votes. You still get your votes in. I'm just glad to have your company. I don't want anyone ever feeling like, oh man, I don't feel like I can be a part of things. I can't gift subs or whatever, or even be a sub, you know? No stress about it, everybody. I was, I was just, I was in someone's stream today and they were talking about, um, you know, they find it really hard to connect with some communities because they can't afford to subscribe. And, you know, when everyone in the chat's a sub and you can't afford it, you just feel a bit like left out. And I just absolutely don't want anyone feeling that way here. It's a free show. Hey, it's a good breakfast. Gonna have a salad, go for a walk. Hey, look, Maccas. <laughs> Yeah, follower only mode on chat, fuck you. Honestly, I, I can understand the logic of follower only mode, but not permanently. If you have permanent follower only mode on, I assume you're just digging for follows. You know what I mean? Which is a useless metric to try and follow anyway, because followers are, you know. Follow, following someone on Twitch means nothing except you get a ping when they go live third last resort for moderation if, you, if you're a channel that requires follower only mode all the time i have two assumptions one you're fishing for follows two you've been trolled recently the first one i've already got all the information i need the second one i don't know your mods aren't doing a great job i guess i don't know it depends on the size of the channel it depends on a lot of factors but 99 times out of 100 Follower only mode makes me go, ugh, I'm leaving and I don't watch. I find typically that it's about getting more follows. Oh, Dante, we'll be taking our time, man. I'm going slow. We're reading the codexes. I'm doing all the side missions. I'm doing everything. Yeah, we're going to be doing this for a while. XP's the exception. I've only seen him use follower-only mode once. 
And that was during Death Stranding. Oh, maybe twice. Last of Us 2. In the four years I've been watching him, I've only seen him use it twice. He uses it for sure, really. I guess I'm following, so I haven't noticed. But I, I, yeah, I, I just, I can't imagine using it for, for every day. Has he got it on full time? Really? I guess there's the outlier because he's definitely not fishing for followers. He of all people is not one, is not fishing for followers. But also he doesn't give a fuck about trolls. So that's, that's really bizarre. Some trolls are really mean. Some are, Siren. But they're just saying anything that'll get your, uh, you know, get your attention nine times out of ten. I find trolls are just really stupid a lot of the time. Just trying to get a rise out of people, you know? It's a Krogan back there. What's he doing? Krogan? Whoa! He came running! Alert. All Peak 15 facilities have suffered a great deal of damage. Biohazard materials present throughout facility. Virtual intelligence user interface offline. Okay. We'll need to get... The reactors back online. Yeah. We absolutely will. Because it disrupts the gameplay, maybe? Maybe. Oh, he does it to fight the follow bots. Oh, sorry. The, 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 the chat spamming bots. I think he puts follower only for, on for the first, like, hour of his stream. So he doesn't get chat spamming bots. I think he's mentioned that, actually. Did, like, 400 manual saves? Yeah, we're at, like, what, 40-something now? Ooh. Garrus, you can have that. And Liara can have that. Garrus is a better shot. Liara is about the biotics. Music's wonderful, isn't it? Why are the turrets facing the wrong way? They want to keep their people in as much as they want to keep others out. Mm, not a good sign when the turrets are facing the wrong direction. Uh oh. Shut up, Manuville. <laughs> uh. I mean, look, at the end of the day, 
What it always comes down to is it's your channel, it's your rules. And you can do whatever the fuck you want with whatever the fuck you're doing on your channel. You want follower only mode on? Put follower only mode on. You want sub only mode on? Put sub only mode. You want to do sub only streams where only subscribers can watch your streams or only subs can watch your VODs? By all means, do it. If that's what you want to do, if that's the direction that you're going and that's how you want to control your content, by all means, please do. But it's going to limit how much I give a fuck about what you do and it's going to limit how much other people give a fuck. When I see a channel in follower only mode, as I said, 99 times out of 100, I'm going to leave because my first snap thought is, well, you just want follows. Nah, I don't care enough. I don't care enough. The thing with Twitch is, and you'll find this with, um, if you, if you ever, if anyone has studied marketing or advertisement at all, um, you're, you are shown thousands upon thousands upon thousands of advertisements a day and something needs to catch your attention within something like, like three seconds. Any piece of anything has, has three seconds to grab your attention. I think on Twitch, a channel has about five to ten seconds. Five to ten seconds to grab your attention and make you go, Oh, this could be good. That might either be the game you're playing, your overlay, your visual appearance, your VTuber avatar, if that's the thing you're doing. Um, your sound, your audio, your audio sound and in, in, in your audio setup in general. Um, your accent, your hair color. These are all things that go into someone's five, five to 10 seconds. If your audio sucks, you're going to lose people. If you're on follower only mode, you're going to lose people. A guy screaming Ivan from a boat. You know, you, you, you've got five to 10 seconds to grab someone's attention and there's so many factors that come into it. One, you don't know who's watching. You know what I mean? Someone might've just popped in the channel just now, like Moogs just did. And they're just scrolling Twitch. They're just scrolling around, right? You don't know who's watching. You don't know who's popped in. And if you're sitting there doing nothing, being boring for five to 10 seconds, that could be the five to 10 seconds that someone joins your channel. <laughs> you know what I mean? So for me personally, you want those five to 10 seconds to be as welcoming as possible. For me personally, this is my thing. If I'm joining a channel, my first five to 10 seconds is gonna mean a lot. And that includes a follower only mode or a sub only mode. There's an immediate decision maker right there. Audio setup is the next. Um, the game they're playing is usually the first sort of barrier to me watching someone. All this guy does is monologue about Twitch signs. <laughs> There's so many factors and for me again this is a personal me thing um if you got follower only mode on you're probably not gonna break that five to ten seconds for me because i just i don't know you i don't care i don't care about you because i don't know who the fuck you are and i'm not going to learn because there's this wall of like you have to follow me before we can interact it's like nah, i don't care next it's just how my brain works and i think it's how a lot of people work I want to interact with the community, yeah. Immediate dodges are those you just sit there saying fuck all for 30 seconds, yeah. Or when you raid someone and they sit there for two minutes not realizing that you've raided them. And then... <laughs> and then get annoyed that you raided them. <laughs> Y'all remember that?
Twitch ads stop you from going to non-sub but follow channels for a few seconds? Yeah. Well, there you go. There's your first five to ten seconds of a stream is ads. Twitch is already making it harder. It's just, it's, it's, it's getting hard to navigate and discoverability is a real fuck. That's why, and I, I hope this does come across. I really hope that this is working or at least it's felt because I am trying. I really try and help the streamers of this community because not only have you given me your time and your attention, you care enough about what I do that you've sat through those five to 10 seconds, you made a conscious decision, you stuck around and you've decided, hey, I actually like this guy or I like the people in chat or both, hopefully. Um, I like the people in chat, but I don't like him. <laughs> you, you made it through that five to 10 seconds, right? You decided that you wanted to be here and you've stuck around for longer than that. And I appreciate the fuck out of that. Playing fast and loose with the definition of like there. Um, so you all have given me that. And then when I find out over break time shout outs or through Discord, um, the promotions channel. By the way, thank you to everyone who doesn't just post in the promotions channel and never post anywhere else and just uses that channel as a copy paste. Thing. Thank you for not doing that, everybody who's not just doing that. Um, you could choose to be here. <laughs> um, yeah. It, I, 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 I want to try and pass that forward to everyone here. If I find out you stream, I want to try and bump that shit up because you gave me a chance. I want to fucking give you something back you know either my attention or the attention of, of, of other people when i don't have the time or anything you know because i don't have the, I, I don't always have the time that i can sit and actually watch twitch but i i, I really try when i can to watch you guys because there are some fucking fantastic streamers here man nachos brohim is fucking wonderful gakarot fucking wonderful Bennyville! He's alright. <laughs> Get the fuck out of here, motherfucker! Liara. <laughs> Do this channel get so preachy? <laughs> Climate change. <laughs> what was that? Animals, wind. This place is in bad shape. Well, that, that's not fucking good, is it? That's not fucking good, is it? Rounds. Garrus is down. Oh God, it was running at me. Xenobiology is not my field. Maybe someone in the labs knows. I'm okay. I'm okay. Whew. Ain't that a fucking beaut? Xenobiology?
Whew. You know, the good bug is a dead bug. No! Good job. Good lift. I save? I can save. Let's save. Let's save. We're good. Save. S save. Jesus. The blue Ashley I saw. G'day, blue Ashley. How you doing? Safe? Safe. The fact that there's power system, Commander. It must be for the station's main. The fact that there's Rachni here is not good. We have heard about the Rachni wars. The Rachni were a fucking scary ass alien. That the Turians, sorry, the Salarians, I believe, had to help the Krogan become stronger to fight. The Krogan had to be made stronger to be able to fight these things. They're meant to be wiped out. And yet... Critical startup error. Virtual intelligence user here they are. Offline. Manual boot required. Would you like to know more about what, Backbone? Mira. Oh, it's a quote from Starship Troopers. I haven't seen it in a very long time. Memory core. Attempt manual reactivation. What the fuck is with Bioware and their goddamn Tower of Hano Hanoi? 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 Bioware love this shit. Get this tower over here. I always fucking love this. Oh, wait. You've played enough Bioware games, you learn to get good at those fucking puzzles. It looks like you're trying to restore this facility. Would you like help? Are we renegade right now? How do I shut this thing up? This system is monitored to respond to the name Mira. May I ask your name? Commander Shepard, Systems Alliance Navy. One moment, please. Service record confirmed. Due to the current emergency, you are entitled to secure access of all systems. Please note that queries relating to corporate secrets require privileged access. Privileged access is only available to Binary Helix executives. This system is ready to process queries. You may access me at any holographic interface within Peak 15. I need to find Matriarch Benezia. Lady Benezia departed on the passenger tramway to the Rift Station subsidiary labs. User alert. The tramway system is currently inoperable. What's the situation here? One moment, please. Diagnostics in progress. Critical failure. Main reactor shutdown in accordance with emergency containment procedures. Manual restart required. Critical failure. Landline connections are disabled. Passenger tram systems are offline. Bit of percussive maintenance. Report complete. Do you have an additional system status query? Do you know why the reactor was shut down? 
I'm sorry, but I was offline at the time. Shutdown could occur if reactor breach seems likely, or in the case of catastrophic laboratory containment failure. Emergency guidelines suggest the frigid environment will kill biological contagions. It may also damage mechanical ones. Turn off the heat and hope the cold puts whatever you have unleashed to sleep. Zero to Nero, he's a raid. He's a raid? Whatever. Zero to Nero. Bless my soul, Nero's on a roll. Coming in with raid and a baby, 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 Nero! Thanks for the raid, dude. How you doing? Out of control? Yeah, that's the one. That's what I said. <laughs> How was your stream, Nero? Thanks for bringing everybody around, man. John, neutral good. Neutral good? Paragon? Makes sense. Thanks for joining us, John. How you doing? All right. That's all I need right now. Let's go fix the tram lines. Very well, Commander. Logging you out. User alert. Main reactor. Hellpoint. Hellpoint's fucking sick, in it? To shut down in accordance with emergency containment procedures. Red Man planet. Side with the paragons. User alert. Now exiting to the roof. User alert. Landline connections are disabled. Passenger tram. Damn good to see online. you, Nero. Nero, what are your opinions on follower-only mode? We we're just talking about it a minute ago. Curious. There is no wrong answer, by the way. This isn't a trick. Sorry, the gunfire is very loud. Yuck. You'd say that if it was a trick. Landline connections are disabled. Passenger trams are offline. Online. How may I assist you? That's all I need. Very well, Commander. Turning down every fight. Yeah, I might have to lower the sound effect volume. Oops. Ooh. Landlines repaired. Yeah, sorry, Nero. Opinions on follower-only mode on Twitch. It makes sense in certain situations, but in general, I don't like it. Turn more people away than encourage them. Yeah, okay. User we're, alert. Main we're about in the same shut boat down then. In accordance with emergency containment procedures. Manual restart required. Makes sense in very certain situations, but generally speaking, it's probably not going to result in good things. And again, it wasn't a. There was no right or wrong answer, really. It was just more of a. You know, give me some input here. What do you think? Hmm. Yes, 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 yes. Okay. Um. I turn the reactor back on. Connections restored. Processing new data. User alert. Unable to connect to hot lab facilities. Do you know why the oh, reactor... We already had this conversation. That's all I... User alert. Main reactor shut down in accordance with emergency containment procedures. Manual restart required. Oh no, not this again. This is an occasional bug that's been happening where Shepard only faces one direction. User what... alert. Main reactor shut down in accordance with emergency containment procedures. I don't know what's causing it. It's only happened twice now, but it's not so bad.
Follow running mode would suit him since he obviously doesn't want anyone in his chat. Well, yeah. Now Simmons, exactly. Main reactor. User alert. Main reactor shut down in accordance with emergency containment procedures. Manual restart required. Absolutely, just Discord. Exclamation point Discord. User alert. Main reactor shut down in accordance. Sorry, turning it down, turning it down. Cryo rounds, baby. Cryo rounds, baby. God, the grenades are good. required. Lines fixed. Night of the Wolf, you most definitely did get a gift sub. Who gave you that one? I can't quite see. Good to see Night of the Wolf. A lot of other streamers use follower only. Just follow and unfollow later. Yeah, you know what? I've done that a few times. Good to go. Time to talk shit. What's that? Follow, talk shit, leave. <laughs> Might be elevated. Oh, the, 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 the glitch. It seems to be when I pull out weapons. Followed, what the fuck is this shit? Unfollowed. <laughs> Wee baby nachos was a prick. <laughs> now entering decontamination and transit hub. User alert. Loose contaminants in the decontamination chamber. Well, that's not good. Access to passenger tramways inadvisable. <laughs> On the hype streamers, yeah. They're locked in. Ooh. The door could be finessed. Plasma purge. I can't do the plasma purge. Oh shit. Oh shit. Control group losing the They're in can't escape. Up the tunnels now. We're sorry. The leads couldn't get to the struck. Come out while you can. He killed himself because he was part of whatever happened here. He must have felt there was no hope of surviving. That killing himself would be easier. Rough. My electronic skill is too low to actually um, purge those things, so we got to do it the old-fashioned way. Well, oh, put the gun away. That's good too.
We good? We good? Those will be the contaminants. Yep. <laughs> That'll do it. <laughs> Sub only chat is worse. I think so. I don't like it. Averia Pitsy, yeah. All patched up. I only turn sub only mode on if we're getting like spam trolled where chat's just full of you know, people do that without they'll en masse come to your channel and spam some bullshit. It's the only time sub only mode ever gets turned on here, and then it's enough time to basically um uh what's the word? take take what they've said what's what's the 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 now uh, allowed version of blacklist blacklist the, the spam sentence Rift Station. in the bot so if that bot comes up if that message comes up then it just gets more to just block list yeah now arriving at rift station binary helix research facility Block terms and phrases, yeah. I've only I've only got a few block terms and phrases. Just the usual shit. Follower mode IRL. <laughs> you must stare at me for five minutes before you can communicate with me. G'day Dapper Cactua, how you doing? All right, before we go into the hot labs. Oh, I want to smoke. So, I won't be too long, everybody. Don't go anywhere. We'll do some break time shout outs. I'll leave you with some tunes. I'll see you very soon. Now I'm, I'm just going to go masturbate. Oh, like I am. a lot, like vigorously. <laughs>
Hello, everybody. Oh, welcome back. Thanks for being here. Oh. <sighs> yeah. Renegade, even 600. Wow. Hefty lead for the Renegades. The turn begins. Welcome back, my friends. Thanks for hanging out. We're off to the hot labs. No, we're not. Hello? Stand down. Sorry, we couldn't be sure what was on the tram. Can those things work at train's controls? Hell if I know. I'm not assuming any goddamn thing. Look, you're human and that's enough that I won't shoot. But I'd like to know who you are. Call me Shepard. I was sent to find an Asari matriarch. Venezia? Yeah, she came through here. The aliens overran the hot labs last week. Only Han Olar got out and he ain't all there anymore. First, we knew the bastards were clawing into my command post. We had a lot more staff then. I'm packing fire and steel. If they want to fight with claws and teeth, it's their funeral. You got my support. The board sent an Asari to clean up the mess. She went to the hot labs yesterday. We haven't heard from her since. I've got business with her. Stay out of my way. All I can do is hold out here and protect the civilians. There's an emergency elevator out by the trams. This card will let you activate it. It can take you down to the hot labs. All right, if you need any first aid, Dr. Cohen's downstairs in the med bay. All right. Uh, tell me about everything. Tell me about Rift Station. I can't talk about everything. What do you need to know? Tell me about the defenses here. Secure enough that you shouldn't poke in corners. I just wanted to offer some deployment advice. You're lucky these things are dumb animals. Three coordinated guys could take this place. Have you checked the layout yet? Easily defensible by a few people. That's not counting the automated defenses. Three coordinated guys could easily take this place. Listen to me. Automated defenses can be overridden. What impresses me most is the turrets, alarms, and cameras. They're all routed through a central location out by the quarantine labs. One guy can lock down the whole facility. The security hub's the last logical fallback, and we'd have cover from the turrets all the way. What kind of research is done here? Beats me. I'm not supposed to know. So long as people don't start dying, it's not my problem. What can you tell me about the aliens? Ask Dr. Olar. He's the only one who made it out of the hot labs. He's the only Volus left in do here. Do it, Moogs. Do it, Moogs. Do it, Moogs. I need to know more about the situation in the hot labs. The facility's off the network. The only way to find out would be to send scouts down the elevator, and I won't send my people to their death. Did the aliens come from inside the facility, or did they attack from the outside? You want my personal opinion? Labs like that exist to do stupid crap that gets people killed. How are your people holding up? We weren't expecting the initial wave. They made it inside. We lost some good people. Those of us left are shorthanded. We've kept order by long shifts and stems. I don't like it, but I don't see an alternative. I've got work to do. Uh. Yeah, I hear that. Hell, man the perimeter. Jesus. Every few hours a group comes up the tram tunnel. It's actually better since we locked down the elevator. We're all in the same boat. I don't know why they keep it's throwing dead. themselves against our we got defenses. It. Even animals should learn not to stick their noses where it hurts. Doesn't look so much better, man. Doesn't it look so much better? There's only the occasional bug I'm noticing. Not including the Rachni bugs. Where did they come from? Were they in the lab? I never went in the high security areas. You're not gonna go to the hot labs, are you? I absolutely am. Lovely. Lovely. 
Cheers is going very well, mate. Celestia Ialis. What? You're a member of the science teams. Recently transferred, yes. Got some armed looters holding up in a building you want to loot, so what do you do? Don't want to attack and lose ammo. Hit some doors and hide to lure some zombies and looters together and have them kill each other. Fucking brilliant, Finn. What do you do here? Molecular genetics. I specialize in biotic enhanced allele specific hybridization. Speak plain. Think you could translate that into galactic? It's a genetic thing. Forget it. You seem less upset about this situation than the others. That is one of the virtues of the meditation you interrupted. Called it, Moogs. Called it. Tell me about yourself. I am Alestia Ialis from the University of Arraeus. Is there anything in particular you want to know, or should I just spout random facts? No need to be so rude. You are interrupting my meditations. Precisely how rude must I be to convince you to leave? Do you know Matriarch Benezia? Why ask me and not your friend? Because I do not know anything about the Matriarch. Then why would I? Oh, fucking fuck you. That's all for now. Then I will return to my meditations. What a bitch. I'm just trying to have a conversation here. I'm trying to do my job. Science pukes. Just bug out and leave him to die. <laughs> bug out. <laughs> <laughs> Shut the fuck up. <laughs> <laughs> Shut the fuck up. Uncertain. <laughs> I welcome you. <laughs> Cautiously. I am curious <laughs> to know what you're doing here. It seems I've been caught up in events. Sympathetically. Everyone here could say the same. For now, with forced cheer, I still have a limited supply of equipment to sell. What's this cell crap? Given the situation, you should freely contribute to the defense. Pointedly, I give freely to Captain Ventralis. You, delicately, are not paid to protect us. Let's have a look. Regretfully. Okay. Ooh. Hmm. Buy Metagel upgrade. All right, let's go through our shit and have chant in here. What's that? Ooh. That's kind of cool, I think. Is it good? Does it work? Is it fun? Click buttons and post in chat. Oh. Less damage, more fire right works good fun yeah yeah the Elcor Excited. This is the greatest day of my life. <laughs> All right, and then and then relieved. It's pleasant. Let's have a look. Regretfully, sell. 
Feels like hype train, just feels very non-organic. Right. Sell all junk. Going on a holiday? Going on a trip? I don't know where that is, Nachos. Whereabouts is that? Pray tell. What? No! Sorry. I haven't had much sleep since the attack. Is there something you need? What sort of work do you do here? I can't say. I signed a non-disclosure agreement. If we survive, I'd like to keep my job. The location is terrible, but the pay is better than any other commercial lab. You're not happy on Peak 15? The outside world doesn't exist here. Just walls of ice and rock. There's only the work, the discovery. It's easy to forget why science is guided by ethics. Maybe we're paying for that now. What do you know about the hot labs? Nothing. I didn't work there. As far as I know, Han Olar was the only survivor. Is he in the medical ward? No, he's staying in the science team's quarters. Be gentle with him. He had a trying experience. What do you do here? I'm a toxicologist. I can't talk about my work. Not that I'm doing anything since the accident. There was an accident here? I can't talk about what happened. Not here. Too public. Talk to Dr. Cohen in the medical ward. He was the project lead. I'm looking for an Asari. Sorry. Well, there's Dr. Ialis over there. There's also our guest, Lady Benezia, <laughs> Captain Ventralis. I know where she is. <laughs> Simmons. <laughs> oh, Simmons. Simmons, uh, Simmons, you're my favorite. You make me, I'm not I promise. I'm not making fun of you. It's ah, <laughs> uh, fuck. That's good. I've done that before too. <laughs> you just fuck it up. <laughs> you meant to say something like, um, "Hey, is that updog over there? You've got some updog on you." You know, um, make some reference to Updog, and then someone will go, What? Yeah, Updog. And then they'll go, What's Updog? And you go, Not much, dog. What's up with you? How are you holding up? <laughs> it would be petty to complain after showering off a coworker's brain. <laughs> it's None all good, Simon. <laughs> <since the attack. laughs> of course, not all of us have guns. It just works on a whole level of I'll like, talk to you later. In what's up, Remember dog? To report any oh, wait. <laughs> Just the comedy of that is really good. <laughs> saying the punchline instead of the joke, which I've done before. <laughs> Fuck, that's good. What, what? What do you want? I don't like your tone. I've had a long day. Don't piss me off. Yes, I'm sorry. I haven't had much sleep lately. What happened to these people? Oh. They're suffering from a toxin. There was an accident. I have a non-disclosure agreement. I shouldn't discuss it with anyone outside of the company. They keep saying that. Your call, dickhead. Suit yourself. I'm 
just trying to avoid an incident. How's the science team holding up? Better than Ventralis's guards. They've been on alert since the first attack. I've been administering stims at their request. But every species needs to sleep. They're getting twitchy, irrational. Are you the doctor here? I'm a doctor, but not 120. The doctor. My specialty is microbiology, not first aid. We had a medic, Dr. Salah, but he's... We lost him. The automatics can handle basic treatment. Mira runs... 60s are good. This is a... Yeah, that's a 60. Talk to you later. Hmm? Yes. Yeah, Morris is fucking lovely, isn't it? Probably my favorite so far. We're discussing up dog payment. What's up dog? Warning, watchdog protocol is active. Oh, uh, wait, actually. We've got to pass to the hot labs. Let's go. <laughs> oh, it's so good, man. It's so good. But you better fucking have a pass to the hot labs. <laughs> Fuck, that's good. I got seven recently with something similar. She said, Can you pass me an ear, bud? I said, Sure, bud. What else do you want? Yaroslav Tartakovsky. Are you here to secure the situation? You mean exterminate? If by secure you mean shoot every monster I see, sure. I am certain you are having strong feelings. But what has happened here, it is our fault. You understand? Wait, is there an Asari matriarch here? Asari? I have not seen one. She is safe then. At Rift Station. Uh, this is not important. You must be listening. Binary Helix found an egg. It was on a derelict ship, thousands of years drifting. This was Rachni's ship. Inside they find many eggs in cryogenic suspension. Rachni? The Krogan wiped them out a thousand years ago. That is so. Billions of lives lost in that war, on both sides. They should have destroyed it. Why hatch it? Binary Helix planned to clone Rachni. They must produce them, create an army. But when they get here, they find this egg is not a common Rachni. It is a queen. After she lays eggs, they move her to Rift Station. They are thinking that without her, they can raise the babies to be obedient. Hold on. Don't you need a male to get eggs? Queens are born carrying the genetic code of their fathers. Eggs are carried away from the colony to hatch alone. Queens can lay eggs in hours and have a colony in days. This is how they spread so quickly. We'll take care of her later. No, listen. The Rachni are intelligent species. They achieve star travel. They are not animals. No, they're far more dangerous. I am thinking that without a queen, Rachni do not develop properly. Her mind is shaping theirs. These Rachni are uncontrollable. Are you telling me I shouldn't kill these things? Uh, actually, I was to tell you the opposite. These Rachni are beyond saving. It is a sad thing, but they must be euthanized. 
I am thinking that the Neutron Purge must be set off. I'm not familiar with the Purge system. It creates bursts of Neutron radiation, kills everything within the station. Things beyond get genetic damage of varying degree. I don't have time for this. If the Matriarch isn't here, we're leaving. Uh, I do not want so much to be here myself. But the Mira system, she will not let you leave. Is failsafe, you understand? You leave without arranging to eliminate Rachni, maybe they spread. Hmm. I am feeling not so well. How do we set off the purge? Arming controls are nearby. All you do is insert the key. Then uh, I will get near and stop. Up! That's not good! Cool, cool, cool. Forgot about that. <laughs> okay. So, backtrack a moment. The science team found a derelict Rachni ship with an egg on it. A queen's egg, which they purposefully hatched. Five nachos, five, uh, which they purposefully hatched and have discovered that the Rachni are actually an intelligent species and that the queen can communicate with them. But the ones we're fighting seem to be running rampant. And the only way to fucking deal with them is to purge them. Connecting. I have full access to the facility and am at your disposal. Initiate the Neutron Purge. Activate the Neutron Purge. I'm sorry, but I can't do that without proper code authorization. Now, we do have the code, but let's just mumble something. Um, uh, six, Semper, Terran, Phone, <coughs> Phone, Brig. That is not the correct <laughs> code. Please report to security for arrest and interrogation. <laughs> All right. Activate the Neutron Purge. <laughs> I'm sorry, but I can't do that without proper code authorization. Flatu Verada. <coughs> code input 87502009. Code Omega Local Execution. Verify. Code Omega Execution in 120 seconds. 120 seconds till this place blows up. Sorry, y'all can't see right now. I'm just gonna hide my camera so you can look at the fucking minimap. Day, rain dog. Two minutes. Let's go.
Time to leave. 30 seconds. Time to leave. <clears throat> well, I think we got him. <laughs> I think we got him. Hey, I learned how to lift. Nice. Jesus Christ. Ooh. Also, I got I got an achievement in all of that. Archivist. Find all primary alien council races, extinct races, and non-council races codex entries. Fuck yeah. Lift. Warp. Shield boost. Barrier. Offensive, defensive. Yep, yeah, yeah, yeah. All good. Oh, beautiful. Thank you for the heads up. Cheers. Fucking shit. <laughs> Gino, doing some scouting ahead I'm for me. Sorry about this, Shepard. We've got orders from Venezia. Open fire! Oh. Oh! Hey, you know what I said about how three men could take this place? How about two women and a Turian? That do anything for you? Not Captain Ventralis. You dumb bitch. Let's fucking go. Leg shot. That'll do it. You get in my way, it's what fucking happens. I'm not entirely sure what just happened. Biotic throw. I threw the barrier, not her, but it still works.
Fuck your cover! Dude, burst fire on this thing is crazy good. save amira good morning Just to be safe. Might be the only time we get the chance for this. Oh, I can't get any closer. I can't get any closer to her. Damn. privilege of being a mother there is power in creation to shape a life turn it toward happiness or despair her children were to be ours raised to hunt and slay Saren's enemies I won't be moved by sympathy no matter who you bring into this confrontation she only says that if you bring Liara Uh, I know we're renegade, but I'm gonna be nice to Liara. Liara's here because she wants to be, not because I asked her to. Indeed. What have you told her about me, Liara? What could I say, Mother? That you're insane? Evil? Should I explain how to kill you? What could I say? Have you faced an Asari commando unit before? Few humans have. You won't look so smug with a hole in your head. Your insolence is a poor mask for your fear. Doesn't she look sick? This fight on insanity in the original game is fucking bullshit. Let's see how we go now. Fucked on standard, yeah. On insanity, it was actually unfair. This was a fight that absolutely required, um... absolutely required like perfect like tactical fucking knowledge of the game on insanity like you needed to know what abilities did what you needed to be able to uh use barrier abilities at the right time and all that kind of shit it was really fucking annoying i can't get a better shot but it's so good what if what if to be a bit unfair but it, that's the thing it wasn't tough it was unfair like actually bullshit
Unenjoyably so, yeah. That's pretty sick. Nice. I want to get like a squad shot. That's pretty sweet. Pigs in the game just not accessible. Ah, that makes a little bit more sense then. I wish I could turn off all these Waverly line stuff. Getting weaker, bitch. Apparently there's still one left. Oh! Motherfucker! This is not over. Saren is unstoppable. My mind is filled with his light. Everything is clear. Nachos, hold until I say, yeah? I expected better from Asari Commandos. 
I will not betray him. You will. You... You must listen. Saren still whispers in my mind. I can fight his compulsions briefly, but the indoctrination is strong. How can he compel you? He's not even here. People are not themselves around Saren. Moral check, you please. To idolize him, worship him. You would do anything for him. The key is Sovereign, his flagship. It is a dreadnought of incredible size, and its power is extraordinary. The ship that attacked Eden Prime? I didn't think anything that size could land on a planet. It has a very powerful Mass Effect drive, but that is not Sovereign's true power. The longer you stay aboard, the more Saren's will seems correct. You sit at his feet and smile as his words pour into you. It is subtle at first. I thought I was strong enough to resist. Instead, I became a willing tool, eager to serve. He sent me here to find the location of the Mew Relay. Its position was lost thousands of years ago. How does something that big go missing? 4,000 years ago, a star nearby went supernova. The shockwave propelled the relay out of its system, but did not damage it. Its precise vector and speed are impossible to determine. As millennia passed, the nebula created by the nova enveloped the relay. It is difficult to find any cold object in interstellar space, particularly something swathed in hot dust and radiation. Tell me where the Mugate is before I lose my temper. Of course, Commander. I transcribed the data to an OSD. Take it, please. Knowing the Relay's coordinates is not enough. Do you know where he planned to go from there? Saren wouldn't tell me his destination. But you must find out quickly. I transmitted the coordinates to him before you arrived. You have to stop me. I, I can't. His teeth are at my ear. Fingers on my spine. You sh you should. Oh, you should. Mother, I... Don't leave! Fight him! You've always made me proud, Liara. Die! Fuck me! Oh, I'm frozen! I'm frozen! I cannot go on. You will have to stop him, Shepard. First to turn on the Council, now on Saren. You're not loyal to anything, are you? <laughs> I suppose that is how history will know me. Mother! Good night, Little Wing. I will see you again with the dawn. They always said there would be a... <sighs> Combat music still going off. No light. They always said there would be a light. I think we're good.
All right. There's still an enemy on the minimap. Might be bugged. Nope, we're good. Never, never mind. Never mind. Never mind. <laughs> I saved, it should be fine. <laughs> okay, that's the second bug we've, we've found. One is Shepard's orientation getting fucked. The second is Shepard not loading into the cutscene. <laughs> oh no, that, real, that rolling on the ground is normal. That wasn't Liara, that was an Asari commando. Just loading back in. Game. This one serves as our voice. We cannot sing. Not in these low spaces. Your musics are colorless. We filled you with enough plasma to pop a tank. This vessel is at the edge. Yet she struggles. You cannot see her magnificence. We are breathing on the embers. We are the mother. We sing for those left behind. The children you thought silenced. We are Rachni. I didn't come here to talk to bugs. You are not in harmony with those who hoped to control us. What will you sing? Will you release us? Are we to fade away once more? The Rachni were a threat to the galaxy. Those tanks are filled with acid. If she gets out of hand, they dissolve her. They made a mistake. They let the Krogan go too far. This is a chance for us to atone. She has done nothing to us. Your companions hear the truth. You have the power to free us, or return our people to the silence of memory. If I let you live, would you attack other races again? No, we, I, do not know what happened in the war. We only heard discordance, 
Psalms the color of oily shadows. We would seek a hidden place to teach our children harmony. If they understand, perhaps we would return. You could have calmed them if I hadn't set off the purge? No. Our minds are not as yours. We can only learn to sing in harmony. Without a mother, children are lost to silence. You should not sing of them in gray and violet. We would have still them ourselves. Are you a survivor from the war? A clone? We do not know. We were only an egg, hearing mother cry in our dreams. A tone from space hushed one voice after another. It forced the singers to resonate with its own sour yellow note. Then we awoke in this place. The last echo of those who came out from the singing planet. The sky is silent. So, Arachni. This queen was not a part of the Rachni War. They weren't even born yet. All the Rachni we've been fighting here in Noveria. The crazy bugs. Not under the control of this Rachni queen. It seems they've been mentally controlled by something else. We know the Rachni are intelligent. We know they can fly and fl fly ships and... They are an intelligent species, and from what she says, if freed, she would take the Rachni to somewhere quiet where they can just live in harmony away from everybody else. Do we free the Rachni Queen, allowing intelligent life to continue? happily in, in harmony somewhere else or do we exterminate and not risk the Rachni returning to fight everybody else we've got a poll up in chat pull that up nachos this is not a paragon or renegade decision this is a This is, this is our decision. Does the Rachni Queen live? Or is she exterminated? The Rachni were a very, very deadly and scary force in the war. That scientist, Tartakovsky or whatever it was, they can lay eggs in hours and have a colony in days. Scary. They needed to beef up the Krogan just to fight them. But... This one is saying she doesn't want to fight. She wants to go and... Go and be free. Somewhere else. It is sunshine. It is very fucking cool. The way they communicate through song and sound rather than, you know, anything we could understand. I'd say that too if you had two tanks of acid above my head. That's true. I mean, do we trust that she's not going to return? Do we trust that she's not just saying what we want to hear to stay alive? Fuck! Flaming Knight, what's going on, mate? I'd probably say the same thing.
But Nizia was being controlled by, she said, Saren. She was saying that she could feel Saren controlling her on the ship, and again, here. How do we not know that it was the Rachni Queen controlling Benezia? Before we put a bullet in her head. A lot of variables here. This is a very important decision. I won't say why and I won't say how, but I will say this is a very important decision. Spiders don't pay rent. <laughs> Cormac, what's up, mate? How are you? The Rachni we have seen are very deadly. And if they're intelligent, can form a fully fledged war. Is it was it a war? Or were they just existing? Tyranids equal trouble. <laughs> How are you, Jam Man? Poll's almost over. Last call for anyone unvoted. Is wiping out an entire species still called genocide? We are aware that this is the last surviving Rachni in the entire galaxy. This is the last one. And the answer is... The Rachni Queen survives. I won't destroy your entire race. You'll go free. You will give us the chance to nice. compose anew. We will remember. We will sing of your forgiveness to our children. And I live on. That's the day Shepard became an insect god. <laughs> the decision is made. Who knows? Who knows what's going to happen? Who knows where we'll go from here? The ramifications of letting... Letting them live. Tell you what though. I will tell you. The last time we did Mass Effect on stream, which was three years ago. Chat killed the Rachni Queen. So everyone who was here for that 
We just What's our next move, Commander? Head for the Mew Relay? Oh, we're down on Naviria, by the way. The Mew Relay could link to dozens of systems. Unless we know exactly where Saren's going, we'd just be wasting our time. <gasps> the Commander is right. We cannot rush off blind. We still need to learn more about Saren. Who put you in charge? Did the Commander resign when I wasn't looking? We're all on the same team here, Williams. Shut the fuck up, We're Williams. Just trying to help. Sorry, Commander. We're done here. Crew dismissed. Novaria report is away, Commander. You want me to patch it through to the Council? Let's talk to the Council. Patch him through, Joker. Setting up the link now, Commander. Is this report accurate, Commander? You found Rachni on Novaria? And then release the Queen. Do you have any idea what you've done? How many generations until they overrun the galaxy? This queen is different. She understands why her kind had to be wiped out last time around. I hope you're right, Shepard. Our children's children will pay the price if you're not. We'll be waiting for your next report, Commander. Beautiful. Scotsman, good morning. Why don't we put that in the report, right? All right, now we go talk to literally everybody. Presley. Yes, Commander. Nothing new. Yes, ma'am. Yeah, I just have to choose that conversation, uh, that Paragon conversation, because otherwise it would be like, it, the, the decision wouldn't make sense. Why am I glad to be off of Novaria? I don't know which was worse, the cold or the corporations. One will freeze your balls off, the other will sell them out from under you. With all due respect, Commander. I have to go. <laughs> all right, see you. Make up a song about why you should vote Renegade. All right, hang on. Steve! Uh, Renegade. Renegade, Renegade, Renegade. Good morning, Scotsman. Uh... What's this? Yeah. When you're walking around the galaxy in your ship, you got a bunch of friends firing from the hip. You're not evil. You're just a renegade I ain't got no time for anybody else but mine If you're on my crew, I'll look after you, it's fine And if you fuck with me, you're gonna get shot in the head I don't want no parade I'm just a renegade Yeah <laughs> That's not bad, that <laughs> That's not bad It's not bad at all. You single? Should do a, uh, a full version of that. Do a full version of that. Make an album of the songs you come up with on Twitch. I've thought about it. I wanted to call it Monolith's Greatest Hits and take all of the songs I've ever made on Twitch, write full versions of every song, and put an album out. Monolith's greatest hits. Hello, Liara. If you are here to talk about Benezia's death, you need not bother. She brought it upon herself. Don't pretend it doesn't bother you. She was your mother. She was. 
but she was not. I prefer to remember Benezia as she used to be, before she was corrupted by Sovereign's power. Gotta, how you doing? Good to see you. The best of your mother lives on in you. Her determination, her intelligence, her strength. That is kind of you to say. I appreciate your concern, but I am fine. Benezia chose her path, just as I have chosen mine. I am with you until the end, Shepard. I like talking with you, Liara. No matter what the subject. You have been very understanding with me, Shepard. Very patient. I appreciate that. I know there are some strange beliefs about my people. I am familiar with the legend of Asari promiscuity. But those rumors have little basis in fact. When one of my people joins with an individual from another species, it is a very deep and spiritual exchange. We do not enter lightly into a union. You make it sound almost mystical. A true union goes far beyond an ordinary melding. It is a connection that transcends the physical universe. Two become one. Thoughts and senses merge, identities intertwine. Memories and emotions weave themselves together, becoming entangled in a single, rapturous whole. It is unlike any other experience. In some cases, it can be a truly life-changing event. It sounds amazing. Are you saying... No! Oh, no! Uh, I am not very good at this, am I? I'm sorry, Shepard. I am trying to explain why I have been so... reserved. The Union is more than just sex. It is the lifeblood of my species, the way we Asari evolve and grow as a society. That is why I have never... Uh, I mean, that is why we must choose our partners with great care. She's a virgin. I want you to be absolutely sure about this, Liara. I am only 106, barely an adult by Asari standards, and I spend most of my time absorbed in my research. I never really thought about it. Not until I met you. You are very special to me, Shepard. But with all that's happened, Saren, the Geth, the Reapers, I do not know if we are ready for this. These are dark times, Liara. Maybe once all this is over. I'm glad you understand, Shepard. There is too much at stake. We need to put aside our personal feelings and focus on stopping Saren. I wish it did not have to be that way. But we all have to make sacrifices. Let's... let's talk about something else. Yeah, we're coming back to the conversation. Though. I should go. Goodbye, Shepard. We're coming back to that conversation. Only 106. Yeah, they live to a thousand. Hey, fuckhead. Anything you need, Commander? Just trying to get a sense of where the crew is. I didn't are. figure you'd have time to talk with all that's going on. I mean, there are reports to file on the Rachni and on Analeus. Yep, too easy to talk. I'll probably be up half the night working on them. I won't keep you then, Commander. Good. I like this little uh, zone you've got here. Very friendly. Stay there. <laughs> now I'm not just going to go masturbate. Like a lot. <laughs> like vigorously. Commander, I wanted to thank you. What for, Garrus? For everything. Taking me with you, letting me be part of your team, I've learned a lot. I've thought a lot about what you've told me, about not sacrificing innocence to achieve and We already goal, had this conversation. About finding the best way through, not just the fastest. I still think CSEC has its flaws, but I understand why they do it now. I see the importance of being firm in the face of evil, not letting it change who I am. Words mean nothing until you turn them into action, Garrus. What are you going to do about it? Well, I'm going back to CSEC. I think I can make a difference there. I'll also reapply for Spectre training, but I'll do it right. I won't compromise myself to get there. The man. If the people I'm sworn to protect can't trust me, then I don't deserve to be the one protecting them. I'm glad you see it that way. Keep that in yeah, mind. We have had this conversation I already. 
Hi, Ashley. Commander. Do you have a few minutes to talk? One on one? Sure, if you have time. Figured you'd be busy with tactical briefings and whatnot. Don't know what I think about us attacking today, of all days. Kind of an ill omen. Good thing I have my rabbit's foot. It should counteract all the negative waves. Just don't wave it around, Skipper. Rex might be hungry. It's Armistice Day, when the first contact war ended. My family always marks it. Since I'm the only Williams aboard, I thought I'd ask you. Why me? You can't think I'm the most patriotic person on the ship. Nah, you just happened by at the right time. Don't tell me you don't know about my family. My commanders always find out. It's not in my files or something? Don't tell me you don't know about my family. We're so special, the Williams is. Oh my god, we're so important. Tell me more. Are you playing games with me? I don't always play games, sir. I'm General Williams' granddaughter. Who's that? Commander of the Shanxi Garrison in the war. The only human ever to surrender to an alien race. You're blacklisted because of your grandfather's cowardice. Cowardice. That's what the Terra Firma party calls it. I'm not going to let our name go down with Arnold and Quisling. Granddad deserved better than that. He got what he deserved. Sometimes you have to fight to the bitter end. You plan to bail if Saren gets the upper hand? No, sir. I die to stop it. Sir can be re uh, referred to um, female to screw with soldiers as well. So now you know. Gonna kick me off the ship, Skipper? You're not valuable. You're tough and decisive. I value those qualities. Just consider me a fire and forget missile. But anyway, less on the I've fire got this side. Before we land, I'm sure you do too. Dismissed, Chief. Less on the fire Man. side of things, more on the forget side of things. Yes, yeah, sir can be gender neutral within the military. Sure. Goddard, I'm so good. How are you doing? Rex. <laughs> that was the whole thing. Shepard. Rex. That was the whole conversation. <laughs> I could be wrong, Nachos, but I believe. It feels like we're getting near the end, doesn't it, Shepard? With Saren, I mean. It fucking better be. If we don't stop him soon, it'll be too late. You'll find the conduit before he does. I know you will. You have to. And after this is all Do I have over, to? when my pilgrimage ends and I go back to my own people, I'll be proud to say I was a part of it. This isn't about you. Saren's looking to wipe out all life in the galaxy. Everyone's a part of this somehow, whether they know it or not. You finished it, Gino? Yeah? But you're the only one doing anything about it. You and your crew. You took me on board and made me feel like I belonged. Not too many people would do that with Aquarian. This isn't getting us any closer to the conduit. Yeah, Juju, they Understood. don't they don't change your overall um and I'm still right. It just here changes your relationship with that person. Go. See you later. Um, so for example, uh Garrus comes into the squad quite renegade. Uh the more renegade options you pick in the game and around Garrus in conversation trees actually can change the way he behaves. Um, we've made Garrus Paragon because we've been Paragon for most of the game. Um, if you're, if you stay Renegade, if you go the Renegade route, Garrus sort of gets a bit more pumped up about things. Um, whereas now we've sort of made him more on the side of, um, of Paragon. It's pretty cool. Garrus changes with you because he looks up to Shepard as a, as a leader, you know. Respects Shepard's input. All right. We can rebuild him. We have the technology. Um, extinct races. Fifth, though now extinct, the Rachni once threatened every species in Citadel space. Over 2,000 years ago, explorers foolishly opened a mass relay to a previously unknown system and encountered something never seen before or since, a species of spacefaring insects guided by a hive mind intelligence. Unfortunately, the Rachni were not peaceful, and the galaxy was plunged into a series of conflicts known as the Rachni Wars. Attempts to negotiate were futile, as it was impossible to make contact with the hive queens that guided the race from beneath the surface of their toxic home world. The emergence of the Krogan ended the Rachni Wars. 
Bred to survive the harshest environments, the Krogan were able to strike at the queens in their lairs and reclaim conquered council worlds. But when Krogan fleets pressed them back to their homeworld, the Rachni refused to surrender, and the Krogan eradicated them from the galaxy. All right. Ships and vehicles. Faster than Sovereign is the flagship of the rogue Spectre Saren. An enormous dreadnought larger than any other ship in any known fleet, it is crewed with both Geth and Krogan. At two kilometers long, its spinal-mounted main gun is likely capable of penetrating another dreadnought's kinetic barriers with a single shot. How Saren acquired this incredible warship is unknown. The prevailing opinion is that Sovereign is a Geth construct, while others believe it is a Prothean relic. Its design, however, hints at a more alien and mysterious origin. The attack on Eden Prime demonstrated Sovereign's ability to generate mass effect fields powerful enough to land on a planetary surface. This implies it has a massive element zero core and the ability to generate staggering amounts of power. The thing with Garrus is he has his own personality and he has his own wants and needs and goals. But what Shepard shows Garrus is how to achieve those goals. So when you meet Garrus, he's very much a, fuck the rules, I'll do what I need to do. But he couldn't because he didn't have any authority. Being on Shepard's ship has given him authority. Right? But, but Shepard is the one who's going to say, now you've got the authority, how are you going to get your goals accomplished? Are you going to be the, I'm going to do things the right way by the books, steer everyone in the right direction or am I going to be a renegade kind of fuck the rules job needs doing the Mako infantry fighting vehicle was designed for the system alliance's frigates though the interior is cramped an M35 is small enough to be carried in the cargo bay and easily deployed on virtually any world with its turreted 155 millimeter mass accelerator and coaxially mounted machine gun the Mako can provide a fire team with weapon support as well as mobility. Since Alliance Marines may be required to fight on any world, the Mako is environmentally sealed and equipped with microthrusters for use on low gravity planetoids. The Mako is powered by a sealed hydrogen oxygen fuel cell and includes a small element zero core. While not large enough to nullify the vehicle's mass, the core can reduce it enough to be safely airdropped. When used in conjunction with thrusters, it also allows the Mako to extricate itself from difficult terrain. Right. Just a bit of information about the Mako. Um, technology. Biotic. Mass relays are feats of prothean. We know what mass relays are. intelligence cool. is an advanced form. Beautiful. Let's pop a save. Good timing, Commander. We got a transmission coming in from the Citadel. Top priority clearance. Is it the ambassador? It's not his signature. I think it's from the council. I'll patch it through to the comm room. Coming from the Citadel. All right. Who's calling us? Commander Shepard, we've received information that may be critical to your mission against Saren. You didn't seem that interested in helping me before. Why now? The council agreed that Saren was dangerous, Commander. That was why we made you a Spectre. We only balked at unleashing the full force of the Citadel fleet against him. Nobody on the Council wants to see you fail, so we contacted you with this latest information. We've received an urgent message from one of our infiltration regiments in the Traverse. You mean spies? Spectres tend to attract attention, Commander, but they are only one arm of the Council. Special task groups are often a better option for monitoring developing situations. We currently have several infiltration units scattered throughout the border regions of Citadel space. This particular unit was gathering intel on Saren. I don't like being kept in the dark. We can't have you racing around the galaxy chasing false leads, Commander. We only contacted you because we feel this may be significant. Unfortunately, the message we received was little more than static. The infiltration team must be in a situation where they can't set up proper interstellar communications. But the message was sent on a channel reserved for mission critical communications. Whatever they were trying to tell us, we know it was important. Considering your interest in Saren, we thought you might want to investigate this. 
find out what happened to our team. The signal originated from the planet Vermeer. I'll look into it. The Council prefers not to become involved in the specifics of Spectre activities. We only want you to be aware of all your options, including Vermeer. Good luck, Commander Shepard. We will keep you advised if we learn anything else. You better. Vermeer, huh? All right. Well, our next stop was Pharos. But also, uh, if we... Uh, Codex. Planets and locations, Vermeer. No, Vermeer is a lush world located on the... It's fine. Uh, race against time. Find the conduit. You need to explore Pharos, Noveria, and the Artemis Tower Cluster and Vermeer to find clues. Pharos is next. Um, but we also have some side things to do. Voyager Cluster, the Yangtze system. Let's do that. The Council are such fucking politicians, aren't they? Local cluster, Exodus, Artemis Tau, oh, Voyager. Oh, this is us leaving um, Noveria. I forgot we got a special cutscene for this. beautiful god i love this fucking game all right prothean data disc lovely that a jeering rare element lovely drakia light metal into. We haven't been to that yet. Scamo on the council mod for Mass Effect. Fuck it, hell. He'd be the Turian counselor. You know that much. <laughs> oh, all right. Just want to check my uh, check my achievements real quick. Biotic lift, biotic warp, gotta use those. Barrier. I don't think we'll be able to 100% Mass Effect 1 in one go, but we'll get very close. Yeah, Gino, feeling good? Hunt for cancel. All right, we have a little bit of running around to do on the surface. I'm with Funt. I'm doing my part. Oops, a daisy. Palladium. Beautiful. We've got to be getting close to having some of these... Oops. Some of these done, surely. One more Solarian ID tag, four more League medallions. God, so many more light medals and heavy medals. A few more Prothean discs, two more Asari writings, four more Tyrian emblems. Okay, a couple of side things. Just the bugs from Starship Troopers, yeah. Yeah, we're collecting stuff. Again, I don't think I'll be able to 100% this in, a pl in, in one go, because there's so many little things of like, use every tech ability, and I don't know if that counts for squad mates. 
That might be worth checking, actually, if anyone knows. Um, when it says use uh, an ability 25 times, does that include squad mates or is that just Shepard? Because if it includes squad mates, we'll be able to do it. Fuck you. Use the squad mates ability yourself. I mean, I can do that, uh, but like, does the squad mates usage of the ability count to the to that uh, uh, score? G'day, Floyd. Of course, the legendary edition just came out. It is starting to get a bit nippy, isn't it, Jay Shu? Apparently, yes, it does count. Okay, cool. Beautiful. Oh, I'll start focusing on that then as well while I'm running around doing all these things. God, it looks so much better. Fuck me. very quickly something up here to check the data disc children's toys and ragged clothes and 24 grand <laughs> yeah, 420 is a sex number, remember? 69 is like drugs or something. Me too, Red. Me too. Okay, once again, it's very quiet. Always quiet in these fucking things until it's not. got no grenades. Just tell me if the gunfire is way too loud, yeah? Interesting. Cerberus! The scientific fucking... Black Ops squad. What the fuck were y'all doing with that fucking... Rachni?
Uh, oh. All right. Woo. All clear. Looks like Cerberus has other bases on this world, Shepard. All right, let's go figure it out then. How do you use uh, uh, italics? Start your sentence with forward slash me. Forward slash M-E. And that'll do italics for the rest of the sentence. Eddie Guerrero. Man, I remember when he died. I was sort of... I was just getting out of wrestling. Like, I wasn't terribly interested in it, in it, in it anymore. Who locked? How you doing? Thanks for the host. It was Eddie and uh, Chavo? Was that his brother? His cousin or something? Were they related? Nephew. Route. Uranium. Yeah, they probably weren't even related. <laughs> All right, well, that's one Cerberus facility shut down. Two more to go, right? APOC. I actually didn't know that. They actually were. There you go. Level up. Happy birthday to the stadium full of people. That's so fucking cool. Wedge Antilles, APOC. Very minor character, but a character nonetheless. Um... Max out your first aid so I can heal you for a bit more. Save. Beautiful. All right, Cerberus, you motherfuckers. Oh, that sounds lovely, who looked? Fuck yeah. Husks. Thorian Creeper?
There's no sign of Kahoku among the creeper corpses. He must be. A oh shit, Kahoku! Cerberus will have waiting for us at the next base. That Thank dude that we spoke to, we went off in search of his crew. And he's fucking missing. Christopher Lee advised the sound effect. Yeah, getting stabbed in the back. I, th I believe the quote was something along the lines of um, Peter Jackson telling Christopher Lee what sound someone makes when they get stabbed. And Christopher Lee says, do you know what someone sounds like when they get stabbed in the back? And Peter Jackson said, no. And Christopher Lee said, I do. <laughs> and then proceeded to do it. <laughs> Sir Christopher fucking Lee. Unreal. What a man. Him and Vincent Price. Oh. Fuck yes. Yeah. What didn't he do? Uh, glitch number three. Saved it. We're good. We're good. Yeah, I've found that every glitch or bug I found, you just reload the game and it's fixed. They've been very minor and I'm honestly not too fast. Is that Kahoku? Oh shit. Yep, it's okay.
homeostasis. Okay, give us a sec, mate. Cheers. Check for a pulse, but find none. Admiral Kahoku is dead. Despite the ferocity of the creatures he was sealed in with, there was no signs of trauma on the corpse. The needle marks on his arm suggest a oh different goodness. means of execution. It's Admiral Kahoku. Cerberus must have tracked him down. Fuck. Fuck, man. No signs of trauma. <laughs> so what does that mean for the mission then? Destroy main Cerberus facility. Fuck yeah, let's do it. For Kahoku! I missed where it was. Journal. Columbia system. Voyager, Columbia, Neferon. How can you tell, Nachos? Rare element. Chief Berkey. <laughs> Moranima, good morning. Let's fucking go. What's going on the other side, Chief Berkey? Choose to take care, mate. Thanks for hanging out. Always a pleasure, man. Anomaly. Debris. Has to isolate again? Ugh, yuck. Just a release story, what one's that, Pitsy? Sorry, man. Just hit up on your keyboard. Hit the up arrow in chat. It should repost it. Had a thing for Randy Scandy, the middle lady whose father demanded to get permission from the King of Sweden, and he fucking did. You're kidding. Had a thing for the daughter of a count, had to get the permission from the King of Sweden, and he got it. Of course he did. Of course he did. Like a sir. They ended up not marrying. Yeah, that's pretty yuck for anima. 
sorry you're stuck with that. That's fucked. Discuss any specific operations. People can read into that whatever they like. That's pretty fucking cool. Well, I, I guess the SAS doesn't have something like the freedom of uh, information that America does with the military. With the freedom of... I think it's the Freedom of Information Act. You can pull up someone's military records pretty easily. But SAS would not have something like that. Hello. Oh boy. You have to request it and it's up to the government to possibly supply it within 30 years. Jesus. I think I got him. Save 66. I'm only allowed to save three more times. I need to hack in order to access a mummified Solarian. You know, I'm not sure. <laughs> Fucking sniper shots. Jesus. I can do that too. Snipers, man. Fuck. Set in Afghanistan, two thousand and six. Three power mortars. What are you, mate? Old mates unit. Probably knew a lot about those guys. No shit. Man, you take care, man. Thanks for hanging out today, dude.
Not today. No, sir. Insanity starting to pick up a little bit. Got there. Jesus Christ, they didn't blink for ages there. Holy shit. You cautiously press a few buttons and an alarm chimes. The optical database is flashing itself. Quickly, you copy as many files as you can to your hard suit's internal computer. It's memory wiped, the computer shuts down, the files are sure to be encrypted, but you've got time to crack them. Just lead the way. Cerberus, man. I ain't fucking around. Jesus. I'll take those. I'll take, oops. I'll take those. I'll check. Take those. Thank you very much. Oh. Thank you very much. very much get the fuck out of here no one wants to see a flashing computer except Ali <laughs> Tally 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 oh Shepard's doing the thing again see if it resets when I leave the building seems too easy um it varies I'm not, I, I haven't got any points in electronics, so I don't know if I'm seeing the harder ones. I'm only seeing like the easy ones. And one last stop before we get out of here. There's some debris that I need to go and check. Still says the journal's incomplete. Oh no. No, no, we're good. <sighs> Neferon.
not that one. Oh, good spar out on stress. Little slippies is all. Little slippies, they happen. What's the bet I can't access this? Oh, I can. Beautiful. Thank you very much. All right. Another N7 mission done. Transmission coming in, Commander. I think you're going to want to hear this one. Yeah. Greetings, Commander Shepard. I represent a party interested in obtaining information on Cerberus activities. If you know something about Cerberus, you better tell me. I suspect Morality I know check, less please. about Cerberus than you do. I am merely an agent for the Shadow Broker. You see, Admiral Kahoku contacted my employer looking for information on the location of any Cerberus facilities. We provided that information on the promise that he would turn over copies of all files gathered from the Cerberus systems to us. Your deal died with Kahoku. Why should I help you? The Alliance is just going to file this information away in some archive. No secret stays hidden forever. Eventually, someone somewhere will deliver it into our hands. Might as well be you. Transmit the files to us and you will be well compensated. I'll transmit the files. I knew you were a reasonable woman, Commander. My employer will remember this the next time you need something from us. There you go. It did sound like Garrus just pretended to be someone else, didn't it? Okay. Um. Cheeky fucker, that Garrus. Yeah, it's pretty normal. It probably was Garrus's voice actor. Message coming in. Patching it through. Normandy, this is Alliance Command. We're detecting your presence in the Attican Beta Cluster. One of our surveillance drones was gathering intel on Geth activities in the region when it was spotted and shot down. You need to go groundside and recover the drone's data module before the Geth find it. Okay, we can do that. Heavy metal surveyed. Elitania. Well, that's where we're landing. Survey. Medallion. Not many of those left to get. Four rings, four planets. All right. All right, get out of here, Nachos. Rest well. Caught hiding in a corner somewhere. <laughs> is your Mass Effect field running? Uh, yeah, yeah, it is. I think so. <laughs> you better go catch it. Ah. <laughs> 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 oh. Um, debris, anomaly, downed recon probe. There's something that I want everyone to see, but I can't recall what planet it's on. If anyone has a quick Google foo that knows what I'm talking about regarding Mass Effect, It's the fun little Easter egg on one of the planets. Does anyone remember where that is? If you know what I'm talking about. That should be enough, honestly. Is 
hidden Fornax magazine. It's the uh, the thing you can't turn your back to. Unless no one knows what I'm talking about, in which case it's going to be even better when I found, find it. Ooh, Prothean. Hello there. I know, Rain Dog, I know. This is some Necron shit right here. On to Rom. That sounds familiar. Uh, do you know what system? Newton system, Kepler Verge, I love you, thank you. We're going there next. I gotta show you guys something amazing. On to Rom sounds familiar, yeah. Yeah, no, I, I... Now that you've said the name of the place, you're right. That, that is what I'm looking for. Now you're intrigued? All right. Just give me enough time to get around these fucking mountains. Nachos, if you can bear with us for... Yeah, yeah, that's what it is. Yeah. I just got a... I got the message. Yeah. Give me... Just give me uh, until I get through this... This place. And then we'll go there next. Hack, hack a rock. Don't y'all be guessing what it is. I didn't see what the messages were, but don't do it. We'll get there. Oh, light spoilers. Okay. You just be careful. Be careful. Red. <laughs> Nothing serious. Ah, oh, cool. All good. Uh, all right. Down recon probe. We'll go do that, and then we'll go to on to Rom. You said Newton, right? Satellite. This is the surveillance drone, but where's the data module? A monkey-like creature oh, seems this will be fun. Seems to have made off with it. Ah. Oh my god. All right, bear with, bear with. We'll get there. 
It'll be worth it, I promise. I think. It's pretty good. Monkey colony? Oh my god. I don't think any emote makes you feel worse when that's directed. <laughs> it is very judgy, isn't it? It's my... Here's the thing, though. If you look at it, especially if you look at it as my Twitter... Um, it's my Twitter profile picture. It looks so disapproving until you look at it up close. And then you realize it's actually kind of a sad look. <laughs> Monkey. Monkey. None of these monkeys have it. God damn it. Just monkeying around, that's all. Just monkeying around. Whoop. Monkey. Return to monkey. Whoa! Failed it. Star points. gonna shoot the monkeys <laughs> all right none of them guess the little beast had it coming this is why you humans have such a violent reputation. Look, there's a few colonies, it's fine. I got instant renegade points for that too. Do you guys see that? How do I get up this? I mean, technically, yeah, they were killed instantly, so... There was no suffering. God damn it. Come on, Mako, get there. Come on, Mako, get there. Do sex with me, please. What the fuck is this? Monkey colony?
They called it a mine. A mine. I'm getting speedy with the little hackings. Did he say making fuck? <laughs> My love for you is like a truck berserker. Would you like some making fuck berserker? He dropped the data module. Got it. It is a miracle the data module is still intact. Your pilot Good morning, should be Vin. able to relay this info to your superiors. Okay. Now we can get out of here. Hostile contact. Oh, for God's sake, really? Wow, the renegade. No. No. All right, you know what? We're going to come back here and do this. We're going to come back here and do it. I just want to show you all the thing and then we can come back and do the monkey stuff. We'll come back and do that. Kepler Verge, Newton. Okay, toxic. <laughs> and let me just quickly survey the system. <coughs> On to rum. Hey, cheers, Toxic. Thanks for giving it a listen. This is what I wanted to show you before the whole monkey thing went, went down. Easy. Good morning, mate. I'm going to paint some fucking minis today. I'm hanging. I'm fucking hanging, dude. Okay, what I'm looking for is on this planet. Cute or death, good morning. How you doing? And play this, no idea what's going on. Uh, there were monkeys, they stole a very important data module that I needed. The detail work it? No, no, I'll have a look. Um, give, me, give me a fucking look when you come down. Oh, 
Hey, um, in this in this continuity, I didn't run over the monkeys. I should be able to. Ready. Something glitched out. I need the Turian insignia. I can't. Hmm. Let me just try a quick. It's either glitched out or it's not here. Possible? Possible's good, man. Okay, there just isn't anything here. It's just wreckage. No, Nacho's gonna see something before he goes to bed. Something that he absolutely missed in his playthrough. A lot of people do miss it. It's a very small thing. It probably wasn't worth staying up longer for, but I like it. And then you go sleep, Nacho. After. Okay, I can't seem to actually interact with anything here. Oh, I've been here. That's why I've been here. We have actually been here. That's why it's not letting me do this stuff. So I just need to specifically find the thing I'm looking for then. I don't need to explore the whole planet. So then it's just a matter of finding what I'm looking for. But I still haven't found what I'm looking for. Um, do we have any, uh... Apoch, is there any indication as to where it might be? Southwest. Thank you very much. Yeah, that's all right. Yeah, get a lozenge. Get a butter menthol. dog cow thing
Oops. Shifty looking cow. Talk. He does look particularly shifty, doesn't he? Don't tell me he's bugged. Don't tell me he's bugged. He's not bugged. <laughs> He's working exactly as intended. <laughs> the shifty looking cow, when you turn your back on him, steals your money. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's so good. <laughs> and he follows you. Oh, you never turn your back on the shifty looking cow. <laughs> that's all. That's literally all it was. I just wanted you all to see the shifty looking cow. He's <laughs> That's it. That's all it was. <laughs> a lot of people miss that. And I just, I really, I love it so much. It's so fucking funny, man. Worth it? Was it worth it? Ugh. <laughs> uh. Too good. We must return to Monkey now, but I just had to show you that. It's just so good. Elitania. Let's go get that thing back. What does it use the credits for? Briefly mentioned in the Dragon Age Inquisition DLC, yeah? Oh. God, it's good. Look at that. What a shot. Beautiful. And that's where I'm going to leave it for just a moment while I go and grab a quick smoke. Everyone who's got to disappear can go and disappear. You're not going to miss anything for the next few minutes. Um, nachos. Love you, brother. Take care. Be safe. Uh, here's some tunes. And I'll see you all in just a minute.
come back as I coughed. Oh, how we doing? Oh yeah, I'll check that bunk. I'll get to that after the bloody uh after the streamy dudes. I'm excited. I love when I get sent things. Getting sent stuff is fun. Oh alright, hi. That was save 69, by the way. Okay, so I think we have to go and do literally all of this again. So let's go and do literally all of this again. Guess I'm not allowed to save. Nice. Never allowed to save again. How are you, Twisted? Man, the Renegades really took the lead. I told you, I told you that it happened, for fuck's sake. Catch the Paragons fucking sleeping. It can always swing. Always. Oh, it's a hazard standing here. That's interesting. Unless it's, the, unless it's a planetary thing. That's a planetary thing. Oops. Just lead the way. Okay. Uh, debris. Upsy daisy. Upsy daisy, upsy doos. We're getting there. We're getting up there. Oh no. I didn't complain. No, I didn't either. But we won't go into it. Like it's nobody's fucking business. You never know. They might leave it. They might leave it. Rev's way on business. It's too early for plot. You never know. We've still got plenty of Mass Effect to go. We're still going to do Pharos. We're still going to collect all of the, uh, you know, what do you call them? The insignias and medals and all of that. There's always time. <laughs> what you don't trust me <laughs> heavy metal survey beautiful my pocket just vibrate or am I going crazy no I did <laughs> Debbie's awake
Backs we go. Oh, that's some serious air. Oh boy, we're good. something over here and I don't know if I've already been to it. I wonder if I can sidetrack what we already did and just go straight to the mine. But I best not risk it in case we have to backtrack anyway. Yo, the gumdrops. Going on. Rasta man, good morning. and check the probe then go to the mine this is the surveillance drone but where's the data module this will be fun. This will be fun. Go and get this mineral. Gold. I love gold. Okay, surely we're almost done with these. Valuable minerals. Six more heavy metals, nine more rare earths, ten more light metals. We've got the Salarian ID tags. We just need two more league medallions. Two more Prothean artifacts. Two more Asari writings. Four more Turian emblems. <coughs> We are certainly getting there. Was it this one? Renegade right now? Guess the little beast had it coming. This is why you humans have such a violent reputation. Wow, 39 points. That's a pretty big gap. Paragons can Paragons can close that gap, no doubt. Renegades have pulled it back from further. I think Renegades had a 50 point differential at one point. The Paragons can absolutely pull that back, but they're running out of time. Yeah, about 50 points. We are probably about the, about halfway through the game. We are resetting in between games, yes.
Okay, now I'm going to save so I don't have to do all that again. Save 70. Sorry. Yeah, that's fair, Grim. You only played two for two minutes? Wow. Missing out. All these chest high walls suddenly make a lot more sense. Now that I know we're going to get fucking ambushed. This guy. He dropped the data module. It is a miracle the data module is still intact. Your pilot should be able to relay this info to your superiors. Save. I thought the story was very default. Really? Wow. I thought two was wonderful, but you know, different strokes for different folks and all that. Barrier mastery, just got it. God, I hate the way they run like that. Snipers are scary as fuck, man. Beautiful. Get the hell out of here. Get sniper. Get snipers are just a fucking pain. I mean, snipers in general are just a fucking pain. It works once an hour, Twiz. Once an hour. Okay. Yeah, they do play their cards pretty early, but I think it works out. I'm 
Okay. League medallions, minerals, Earthian data discs, Asari writings, insignias, Citadel signal tracking. Hostile takeover. I don't know if I want to do this one, but we probably should. Hey, thanks, man. Gemini Sigma, Han. I appreciate it, Twisted. Han. There's a crime lord here that I need to eliminate. Now that we're renegades, we know it'll be even more appreciated. Matriarch's writings. Good. We don't need many more of those. Light metal. Lovely. Can land on Mavagon. And we will. Yeah, I'm inclined to agree. I think I think two works quite well, but I also might be easy to pleasing. There's a crime lord here that needs to be brought down. Now we were set up by someone who I believe what it seems to be is a situation where the person who hired us is trying to climb the ranks of the business by eliminating, you know, their higher-ups or their competition. So, the person who hired us doesn't have exactly the best fucking ideas in mind of bringing crime lords to justice, but it appears they'll pay us all the same. And it's two less crime lords to deal with, so... Maybe not for the right reasons, but we are doing good. Which really is the renegade way, isn't it? Doing good, maybe not for the right reasons. Maybe not the right way. The end result is the same. Dude on the motorcycle? Whoa. Lorenzo Llamas? No fucking clue what you're talking about, Twisted. <laughs> Sorry, man. It was an old TV show. Ah, oh. yeah, no clue. Anybody familiar? Trey Dog knows what you're talking about. You to death knows what you're talking about. I'm glad someone does, because I've got no fucking clue. Lorenzo Llamas. There you go, Scotsman's got it. I think I'm the only one who doesn't get it. I took a basic bot and customized it, Felon. I'm using, um, I've been using this same bot since I started streaming. It used to be called Ankbot. Uh, and then Streamlabs basically bought it. Uh, it's now Streamlabs Chatbot, but I've been using it since before it was Streamlabs branded. I've tried a lot of other bots and it's really the only one that I like. Ninety two to ninety seven, right. All right. 
What do we got? Krogan gone early. Thank you very much. We do not want to deal with Krogan. Oh, never mind. There's another one. Krogan be scary. You watch the Green Lantern movie? Was it as bad as you remember? Uh... Yep. Oh, that was him. That was easy. Now just, just kill his goons. I don't know why they're still fighting. Their boss is dead. What's the point? I guess to not get killed themselves. Lena was right. These guys had quite the operation going. One down, one to go. Let's go see what they had going here. They heard Renegade was leading. <laughs> Let's see just what kind of operation they've got going on here. Wetware kit. Ooh. Heavy armors, sell those. Malfunctioning object. Thank you. Technician kit. Thank you. Secure crate. Beautiful. Let's get out of here. Renegade is leading right now. You love spaghetti westerns and westerns? I like... I like spaghetti. Just as a general statement. <laughs> I also like spaghetti westerns. They're good. Get out of here. One down, one to go. And the next place we need to go... Hades Gamma, Dis. It's some of this. Hades Gamma. This.
huge Western and sci-fi geek. I'm a big sci-fi fan. I don't know if you could pick that up. I've never been much into fantasy with the exception of like Lord of the Rings. Um, Western is something that I've always appreciated from a distance. Tyrion Insignia, lovely. Let's go pay him a visit, shall we? Oh, yeah. Both on VHS, either NASCAR or Westerns. Oh, John Wayne. Uh, syndicate hideout, anomaly, anomaly. All right, we'll, we'll do the roundabout trip. Can't believe how much the Renegades turned it around, man. It's crazy. Sneaky fuckers. Platinum deposit, lovely. <laughs> That's just not true. Oh, is this it? It's something. Thousands of players on each of the Final Fantasy fourteen data centers are lining up as Dark Knights with campfire minions as a tribute to M M Muira. I don't know what any of that means, Dapper. I'm sorry. <laughs> the resolution's nice, isn't it? The author of the Berserk manga died. Ah. Oh.
Okay. Blocking my shots, Liara. Sorry, I need you to move. He's in stasis. Lovely. Mission accomplished. Berserk was the primary inspiration for Dark Souls, Dragon's Dogma, Bloodborne. Really? Bloodborne's primary inspiration was like Lovecraft stuff. Still. I, I've heard a lot about Berserk, but I've never seen it or read it or know anything about it. My knowledge of, of Berserk is the name and a character named Guts, and that is the extent of my knowledge. Shit. Shit. There we go. Got there eventually. That's all you need to know? I know Seven is quite familiar with it. But I don't know fuck all. Her parents decided to name them Crime Boss. Is the brand from Berserk flipped upside down? Oh yeah? There you go. That's really cool that they're doing that in Final Fantasy then. Paying some homage. Shoothy! 11 months, motherfucker! Welcome back! G'day, Rin. Shufi, thanks for keeping that sub rolling for 11 months, dude. Huge. Almost a year of Shufas. Come for that one year. Fucking oath, man. Ah. Renegade is in the lead. Old footprints, but no sign of the survivors. Okay. Oh shit. G'day. Mummified Solarian.
Medallion. Don't need many of those. Did we get a level up? Oh, we did. Oh, hell yeah. Advanced throw. Lift. Liara. First aid. Garrus. Assault training. Save. Okay. That leaves... Syndicate hideout. Debris. Oops. Go get that debris. There's also my, uh, probably my least favorite cheese is debris. I like the cheddar, the mozzarella. The feta is my favorite. Manual bypass. Gotcha. Okay. Syndicate hideout. Oh, we already did that. We're, we're done here. We're done here. Fuck yeah. Fortuna, Horsehead. Where we're we going? Woo! One more medallion. More materials. One more riding. Horsehead Nebula, Fortuna system. Horsehead is. Naviria. Fortuna. Amaranthine? Ah, that's where you are. Sandwich! Hello there, Sandwich. Thanks for the raid, my friend. How was your stream? Bringing everybody around. to the goddamn show where we're doing literally everything in mass effect because i fucking love this game and i never want to stop playing ever what were you streaming today sandwich give me the rundown give me the goss give me all the details onion night <laughs> hmm hmm how are you, mate? Welcome in. Just chill. Love a chill day. My day's going very well. Thank you, sandwich. The Hunwich Gang. Jesus Christ. Darkness falls. I've played a little bit of Seven Days to Die. Just a little bit. I've enjoyed what I've played. What's the uh, Darkness Falls mod? What does that add? Nights last longer. Something like that. Iridium. Thank you very much. Well, I hope it was a wonderful day, Sandwich. I hope everybody uh, coming in from Sandwich's show. Hope you enjoyed here too, playing some Mass Effect. It's my favorite game series of all time. I fucking love it. That's more RPG elements. You gain skills, raise basic skills and everything you do. Trying to close Demon Gates like an Oblivion. Wow, that is a lot. Sounds like a full overhaul. Crazy.
Anomaly Engineering Outpost. More points to Renegade Bunk. Fucking hell. You know, planet exploring feels a lot less tedious. A lot less tedious than it used to. Please, no Thresher more. Please. No. Okay. What's that? Turian wreckage. Looks Turian. Turian insignia. Lovely. Was that the last one I needed? No. One more. Oh, I need one more for so many things. Um, oh, we're all, I've, I've almost got all the collectibles. Hello there. Horde Knights, people you buy from are no longer safe areas. Wow. Raise animals like they have a pet. Oh, Jesus. Doesn't work well. Still working on the mod. What a lovely outpost of death you have. Up a save. Let's go and say hello. I just heard a gunshot go off. Oh! Hello again, Commander Shepard. I owe you a debt of gratitude. With my former partners dead, this syndicate is now mine. I could not have done it without you. Those men deserve to die. Now are we gonna have a problem? Not if I can help it, Commander. I hope you can see that I am by far a lesser evil than those men. Under my leadership, this organization will restrict itself to gambling and smuggling illegal technologies. There will be no drugs and no slave-taking for the Batarians. Those days are over. I'm giving you one chance to live through this. Shut this gang down. I cannot believe you place such a high priority on stopping such petty, victimless crimes. If I disband the gang, I walk away freely. I have not come so far to be arrested. I would die before going to prison. I would most certainly kill before going to prison. Now, do we have a deal? You're free to go. I don't ever want to see this gang again. If I do... You won't. I'm not so foolish as to break my word to a Spectre. Now, if you'll excuse me, my men become nervous in the presence of law enforcement agents. <laughs> Goodbye, Shepard. All's well that ends well. Look at that. Renegade points out the wazoo. Mission accomplished. Have a good one, Helena Blake. Gangs disbanded. Two crime lords are dead. She goes free. Not so pleased about that. But the mission was a success, nonetheless. And I, I'm going to call that a win right there. Job done. If, we, if she tries anything, we put a bullet in her. Easy. Okay, we've got one mission to do on the Citadel. We've got some more collectibles to find. Where haven't I been yet? Attican Beta.
Prothean data disk. Fuck yes. Light metal, okay. Back out of Theros with Binder Hercules. I think we've been here already, but no harm in looking. No harm in looking. Plover. Doesn't ring a bell. The Mal. Edmos. We may have been here already. Yeah, we've been here. Okay. Farinata. Fairly certain we've been fa to Farinata. Okay. Have we been to the Styx Theta yet? Erebus? Archeron. It's hard to remember where we've been. <laughs> In Mass Effect 2, it becomes a lot easier to see what you've explored and what you haven't. Light metal. Okay, I guess we haven't been here yet. We can land there, and we will. See if there's anything. Find someone named Ivan, we can punch him? Absolutely. Absolutely, we can. Okie dokie. <coughs> Listening post. Hold the phone. Turian insignias, one more, one more, one more. The medals are gonna take some time to find. One medallion. One more of everything except the medals. Fuck me. Samarium. God, the worlds are cool. Something else on the map. I just, it, I, I keep forgetting that I'm covering the map so y'all can't see uh, the mini map. Probably just looks like I know everything really well. <laughs> Hello there. Let's just pretend that I do. Let's pretend that I know everything really well. I've just memorized where everything is.
So I think I've already sorted out my plans for the rest of the day. I'm going to be painting some minis with, uh, with old mate Beersy, I think. We've got an iron strider I'm halfway through uh, building and painting. What do you guys got planned for the day? Asari capsule. Is this the last writings? Plodsky. Matriarch's writings. Done. Plod. Babe. How you doing? Is that really it? I don't get anything for actually having done it. No, it's just a, it's just experience. Experience is good though. Plot, how'd you go with deciphering the Grey Knights? took over. Gotcha. Sorry for harassing you about it yesterday. Flamingo, we've flipped, mate. Raiding with your new raid group. That's exciting, though. I hope it's good, man. I hope they're a good crew. Yeah, hard one for you, Plod. I didn't even know who he was until today. feel a little bit guilty about. Oh, boy. bad for not knowing every creator. I know, I know. Well, if they've had as much influence on things that I enjoy as they have, I, 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 should, I feel like I should know these things, you know? If they've had that much influence on shit that I love. Should be in the know, at least a little bit. Lovely. Lovely. Let's see what else there is to discover. How long have I been live for? Six and a half hours. Mayday. 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 This is Lieutenant Marie Durand, 314th Infantry, Alliance 10th Frontier Division. The listening post has been overrun by unidentified hostile life forms. Request immediate extraction. How'd that work out for you? Commander, you see this? They just received a supply run two days ago. The Ragni worked fast. Where'd that supply ship come from? I will need a moment. 
This base is supplied by drone freighters dispatched at irregular intervals from different depots to reduce the likelihood of tracking. I have it. This one came from Argos Row. Let's kill something. Let's get this over with. Somebody needs an ass kicking. Whoever it is, we'll find them there. Very well, Shepard. Let's kill something. The Rachni infestation on Altahi seems to be the result of a supply drop from Argus Row. Logs downloaded from the freighter should allow you to backtrack the ship's course to Bexel's origin. Cool. All right, let's go. Let's go kill something. You're harping on about Ultima? Yeah. Exactly right. And that's why I've taken such an invested interest in your Ultima sort of... Your, your run, Finn. I actually... I've been watching your VODs and, and sort of keeping up. I'm not keeping up at all. I'm way behind. I only get a couple hours a day and I spend most of that time <laughs> not on Twitch, but I've been, I, I want to keep up with all your VODs and um, really get a feel for where it's all gone. I don't know if I'll do an Ultima series playthrough, you know, the way you've done it, but I would love to see it all, you know? Argus Row. Well, because it, it's, you know, not only have you sung its praises for so long, but if it has had such an impact, you know, I, I feel like it would be. It would be the right thing to do is to is to at least get a feel for it you know and what better way to get a feel for it than watch a friend play through literally all of it you know where are we going listening post alpha Erebus and the Styx Theta. I thought they said... Okay. is where I'm going. Metal. Chofen. Prothean data disk. Fuck yeah. God, it's hard to want to stop, man. If I really wanted to, like if I wanted to go for another like maybe three or four hours, we could finish this today, but. I want to really soak it in, take my time, explore everything. Oh, all right, Finn, I'll have, a, I'll have a little squizzy squiz. One more league medallion, two more heavy medals. One more Turian emblem. We've almost got it. Very nearly. JJ, Sathalan, bringing up the Renegades. Anomaly, Anomaly, listening post, debris. If you want it, you can drive. Take a ride into romance. You can drive if you want. If you want it, you can drive. Never gonna stop our dance.
Please, these particle bores were shut down after breaking through tunnels just below the surface. Interesting. I don't like that. I don't like big ground holes. Go for debris. <laughs> Oops. Anomaly. Never gonna stop our dance. You can drive if you want. Uranium. That seems helpful. Rare element surveyed. Lovely. Did you get so much cash and experience just for scanning these things? Rain dog bringing up the paragons. Only a true Paragon nuke. We're not going to talk about him as a character because we haven't met him yet. But yeah. Only a Paragon would. Only woman. Touch me the right way. Yeah. Only a woman. Is allowed to touch me there. Please make a buried safe box. Medallion. Done. Lovely. That leaves just the Turian insignia. And the minerals. And that's it. Maxed out on credits. Wow. Just by flogging spare shit. Honestly, you can. If you don't carry... If you don't bring a different party every time and you stick to one party, deck out that party with the best, you know, stuff for what you need. The rest of the, the, rest of the party doesn't need stuff. So you just sell everything. And the further in the game you go and the higher gear you get... You know, it... It's just money making. The frog are hacking, yeah? Come on, get up there. I'll just say, by the way, thank you everyone for being here. I know I say it a lot, but this is just such an important game for me. This trilogy is so important to me. Um,. And to have you guys here experiencing it with me, some of you for the first time, some of you for the hundredth time, it just means a lot. I really appreciate it, everyone. Thanks for hanging out. What's this? Probably where I'd have to go. Is it locked? Yeah, we'll have to come back here. Okay. Throw yourself into a game? I mean, if there's ever been a game for me to throw myself into, this is it. So 
something that I just... I can't help but want to do everything and see everything and show you guys everything and... Oh. Just does something special to me, man. Way more than Yakuza, way more than uh, Ma uh, Metal Gear. Fuck, I wrote a song about it and put it on a goddamn album. The rest of my band haven't played Mass Effect. They've got no fucking clue what anything means. Oh. First Lieutenant Durand, ma'am. 3rd Brigade, 14th Infantry Regiment. And I am damn glad to see you. Hell of a welcome. How'd it get this bad? Damned if I know, Commander. They dropped us here a few months back. We get supplies every couple weeks. We didn't see anything local that was more dangerous than lichen. Yesterday, these animals started coming out of the ground. No idea where they're from. This is what's left out of 90 men. I'm the ranking officer. If that's all they had left, you must have done a lot of killing before we got here. That wasn't all they have left. Not by a long shot. What we just fought was a probe. Our seismic sensors are picking up a crap load more on their way up from underground. Crap load. We've got five minutes. Tops. We might be able to hold them off if we were at peak. But you can see the fighting's busted this place up. Secure those negative waves, Durand. You and me are gonna hold this worthless rock. Look to your people. We'll see if we can fix your defenses. Aye, aye, Commander. Got you covered, Durand. the woman. Everybody pool magazines and grenades. Take a leak and a drink while you can. And if anyone wants a smoke, it's as good a time as any. You got 30 seconds, everybody. 30 seconds. Heading out. Red Planet switching gears. Bringing up the Paragons. I just want to see if I have anything better than what I'm using. Not for DPS. What about shotgun? Less accurate, way more part firepower. Thank you very much. Thank you. Go with that. Go with that. Liara. Give you that. I'll give you that, actually. That seems better. Give you that. Give you that. And have that. And that. Garrus. Less DPS. Heat sinks better though. Ah, oh, take that. And perhaps no. Take that. Beautiful. Ten seconds. Up a save. Hey, she's mine, Rain Dog. I, I, I got eyes first.
This ain't so bad. This ain't so bad. What are y'all worried about? This is easy. Do I need to be doing something? Because it's just saying another another swarm is approaching. It is the swarm that is approaching. Redeploying. Generator. Oh. Ah. We leave the generator up. Guess we won't be leaving, huh? Okay, I see. I, 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 I see. I see. Can't go very far out, can I? wanted to get like a really good that's pretty cool that's pretty cool that blue line is kind of fucking with it but it's pretty cool and mid battle I gotta go take a piss so let's make this the last break of the day I'm gonna go grab a piss have a quick smoke I won't be long don't bloody go anywhere see you in a minute isn't that a cool fucking shot? Isn't that cool?
Hi everybody, welcome back. Thanks for sitting tight for a moment. Oh, let's continue, shall we? Really, ha I really was hanging for that piss. We almost good. Here it comes. Good to go. Surely we're close, right? I'm doing my part. Garrus doing? How long does this go on for? Call me Shirley. <laughs> we good? That's the last of them. Holy hell, ma'am. Talk about a near run thing. You all right? Just getting warmed up. I'm pissed off. When I get pissed off, I shoot things. Find me more bugs. <sighs> Around here, they're more likely to find you. Ma'am, we're getting a signal from one of the ground scan UAVs. Good day, a big hollow space about 500 meters under the surface. Right, that must be it. That must be where they're coming from. My people aren't in any condition for a clearing operation, though. I have another mission I need to complete. Can't do it for you. Understood, Commander. I wasn't asking. We'll hold until an evac ship arrives. If you want to take a throw at it, we'll give you the coordinates. But it's your call. I gotta do it. You saved our asses, Commander. Thanks. Mako's all busted up. Whoops. How do I heal again? Little repairs you do. Those all doing is free experience, exactly. Of 
course I'll fucking do it. Speaking of experience, how far off are we from the next level? Oh, we'll get it. We'll get another level right here, I reckon. Right, Miv? Completed day at work. 200 experience. Your can stacking skills have just gone up. Now you can do it easier and faster. Now you can magically levitate the cans onto the shelf. <laughs> Save. Pop, 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 pop. Lovely. I kill some bugs. Seem there. Jesus Christ! Oh. Uh, uh, uh. Up. Thank you. I was about to say it doesn't seem very infested in here. deployed. <sighs> I think we're done here. Fucking Jesus Christ. Can you not? God damn, can't save. Negative contact. That's not true, Garrus. Fucking Jesus Christ. Mm, 
dying. I'm dying. I'm dying. Haven't got any meta gel at all. I'm regenerating though. I am regenerating. Thank fuck for health regen. Slow as it may be. the same thing but slightly better <sighs> Rachni man I got two. not trying to flank me are they there's two of them one less We need meta gel.
Still no meta gel. But I can save. I can save. That's all right. Algeros. Happy seven months, mate. Welcome back. How are you, Dal? Good to see you, man. Health regen, please. Waiting for the coffee to kick in, I hear that. Shit. Fuck. Drag frame bringing in the paragons. So they're healing. I don't like that. One down. Records of the Rachni War suggest brood warriors, the male gendered Rachni, only fight when a hive is severely pressed. 
It's safe to say you've eliminated the rack now. Well, there's still one fucking there. There he is, the last one. Holy fucking piss, we did it. Oh. Let's get the fuck out of here. Rachni Queen is alive. Garrus. Hey, Daldross, have you played Mass Effect? PC, Darth Benton. You haven't? Oh, Dal, mate. Highly, highly, highly recommend. Lulu, good morning. How you doing? Partner played them? Oh, mate. Absolute joy. I love them so much. It's my favorite game series ever. They can make a new colony in like three days. Yeah. Well, not with it. Not, you know, with them all being dead, they can't. But fuck, man. Goes back and forth between three different games. Yeah, what's, what, what are they? Ranima, that's not great. Mass Effect, Suikoden, and Yakuza. Never played Suikoden. Not familiar with it. Oh, we've been there. Where haven't I been? This is where DLC happened. We've been here. Back to the Citadel. What level are we? 24. Six away from max level. Oh wait, no, it's under 60 now. So we're almost half leveled. Almost. Just quickly, wanna have a look at the achievements list because I think I've got quite a few of them now. What am I missing? Not much.
Complete the game. Main mission, main mission. Biotics, abilities. Yeah, not a lot, really. Equalizing interior pressure. Not a lot at all. Atmosphere. Classic Locked. leveling. The new. The oh, is the new one 30 is or is the old one? Exo Presley Was it 60 or 30? I can't remember. I chose the new leveling system. So if the new one's 1 to 30, right? In light of the recent attack on Eden Prime, myself. many colonial investors are pulling their support for future projects. Proponents of expanded human colonization insist that Eden Prime was an isolated case. Nevertheless, colonist enrollment has dropped sharply. Mm. That'll Many happen. colonial proposals are on hold until backers have some reassurance that human colonies will be adequately protected. US 30, right. So then we're almost max level. So we code in. Translates to the water margin. Face of an old story of 108 bandits. Gameplay is typical JRPG stuff, but your party can consist of the player character and five party members. Over a hundred members. Wow. It's pretty cool. I think we're maxed out. Ooh. Less damage, more heat sink. Cool. Cool. Now hold that. You can hold that. Just going for damage output with the uh, the party members because that's really the most important. Their accuracy is less important. If they hit, they hit. I think everyone's got the best shit they can be holding. Means we can sell everything else. Make some money, 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 money. What's the current level? 26. Hello, Show me what you got. 26 or 24. I'll open the rare stock. We're getting close. Commander. Enjoy. Okay, sell. Sell all junk. Look at the money. Look how much cash we've got. Beautiful. What have you got for sale, sir? Naginata? Slightly better than what I've got. One ninety. Wait, what the fuck is Liara holding? Why is Liara's sniper better than mine? Hang on. Liara. Hello, Commander. <laughs> it's fine. Goodbye. I think I'll be going. Commander. You okay. Have now. I have a question, and I don't know if it's because I'm missing something or if something if I've done something wrong here. I, it's been a while since I've gone for it. Spectre weapons. Is that a new game plus thing? Do I not have access to that? 
I don't recall. It's been a hot minute. It's not a New Game Plus thing. Yeah. Uh, I, I didn't think it was New Game Plus. Just didn't know when. Oh, well, can't be far off. What the fuck? Let's <laughs> walk it off. Yeah, what is it? Seems the owner didn't like the way you played their games. Doran didn't have a clue what I was doing. He, he assumed I was cheating. I know Doran. If he says you're cheating, you're cheating. I was just tipping the scales in my favor. Only as an experiment. Still sounds like cheating to me. To you, maybe. But this device is merely intended to simulate situations and record results. Recording losses is easy, of course. Nobody notices those. Why do you need to record these outcomes? Ah, now you're getting to the heart of it. I've spent the last five years developing a system that can accurately predict wins and losses on the Quasar. I just need a few more recorded wins and I can complete the algorithms. Can you do that? Isn't that illegal? It's illegal to use my system, but I won't use it. I'll sell it to others. I just need a few more wins recorded. Yeah, I'll, I'll do help it. You out. We're renegades. Ah. We'll do it. I suppose I could let you try it. Here you go. When you've recorded enough wins, it'll let you know. Of course, if you get caught with the device, well, you saw what happened to me. <coughs> well, off you go. That data won't collect itself. It's not what I heard. And what did you hear? Oh, Rita. Hi, Rita. Hey, Jenna came back looking for work. Thanks for getting her out of Cora's den. No problem. I was glad to help out. Yeah, everyone seems real happy to have her back. I sense that you are less than pleased with her return. I'm glad she's out of the den. I'd just forgotten what it was like to have her around. I haven't had a decent tip since she got back. Shadowgeist! 43 fucking months! I'm waiting for someone else. Hey there, welcome to Flux. God damn, Shadowgeist! Which story's your favorite in the Citadel? This one. And the next one I go to. Shadow Geist. Thank you so much for 43 months, man. Fucking hell. How many wins do I need to fucking put in? Feels like yesterday, doesn't it? Crazy. Don't often see someone getting as lucky as you. What are you getting at? Hey, Doran. Hello again. Can I help you? Give him Shell's tool. Just passing through. Enjoy your time here at Flux. No, no, we're not finishing it today. No way. I was just saying, like, if I wanted to, I could have. But I'm enjoying the process a bit more. I'm just taking my time. skip all the dialogue that's what i mean like if we really flew through it and just stuck to main shit we could get it done we could have got it done now not so much where's the fun in that where's the adventure in that man it's not the way i want to play this your luck seems unnatural does it i just lost twice
You gotta enjoy all of it, exactly. I'm down 65 credits. Yeah, we've been going to every planet, fucking doing everything. Shells! So, did you record five wins with the device yet? Here you go. I hope it's what you're looking for. Excellent indeed. This will provide me with invaluable data. You enjoy those winnings. I'm gonna get the system completed. Alright. Good on you, Shells. Does that help me with the Citadel tracking though? No. Can anyone tell me where the ward's access corridor is? I've been looking for it. We, I don't know what they're calling the access corridor. I thought it was where we met um, Tally for the first time, but I don't think that's it. Does anyone know? Yeah, the access corridor. I've checked all the things that I thought were the access corridor, but... I believe it is. I went there. I went there and it wasn't that. I'll check again. The long haul. Wait, this. This one? This is the ward's access corridor? Did I miss this door every time? This one? This is the access corridor. Discovered a signal being used. If you can trace the system, you can find out where the money is going. The signal seems to be coming from the ward's access corridor. But there's nothing here. Another hallway after the elevator. No, I think that's just the elevator. No. So if it's not down there... It's not over here. See, there's a couple of places you can access the wards. Yeah, exactly. You go, you go through C-Sec and shit. I mean, there's down here as well, but that's Officer Lang and he doesn't have anything to say. There's this corridor here. But once again, nothing here. I was very certain that it was where we met Tally, that red corridor, but... There's nothing you all saw. There's nothing there. From memory, that's what it was, but... Unless it's bugged. And we just can't finish that particular mission. Streamer exposed. There's another hallway between that elevator and the Presidium. Oh, sure. I can return that for you. Thanks. Hasn't worked well since I bought it. Oh, this guy, this poor guy. Hey, are you refunding his stuff? Here you go. Your account will be credited. You did. You took his return. Look, I'm telling you, I bought this here. Why won't you return it? I can't take it back unless. You... I know, I know. Unless I have a proof of purchase. This poor guy just trying to get a refund. Hey, Conrad. A commander. 
I've been waiting for you to get back. I've got an idea, and I wanted to run it by you. Go ahead. What's on your mind? With so many human colonies being attacked, I'm not sure that one specter is enough. What if you signed me on as another specter? You gotta be kidding. Conrad, I haven't been shot in the head nearly enough times to make that seem like a good idea. Joke if you want, but there were people who didn't believe in you. Should've kept his receipt. And you worked out, right? I know you're afraid to trust people after losing your team at a coups, but I'd never let you down. Here's a test. All right, let's see. I'm a bad guy. Stop me from killing you. What? No, please. Please don't hurt me. Why are you doing this? Because you're not a soldier, Conrad. You can't handle this. Go home. I thought you were a hero. Heroes don't do things like this. Oh, Conrad. I wish I'd never met you. Oh, Conrad. Conrad, no. Okay, there's more land. Yes, human. You need something, yes? What do you know about Baines? I have never met him, human. Okay. Oh, you will be pleased, I think. Very good things I have. Geth Armory License. Nah, he's not going to have anything better than what I've got. Don't meet your heroes, folks. Okay. There's another hallway. Oh! Trey Dog, it's just occurred to me what you meant. I'm trying... I'm looking in the wards for the access corridor, but... It's not, it's the, it's the corridor that leads to the wards, not out of the wards. It's just a fucking, just occurred to me what you meant. There's literally a place in the Presidium called Wards Access. It's right here. I mean, this is the Wards Access corridor. Is it not? Is it not? Let all races herald the glory of the infused. Well now I'm really fucking confused. There's a hallway that connects to elevators if you take that elevator. Okay. Okay. So take the elevator and then there's another corridor. Wait. To Presidium. To Wards. Exel Jenny Corp recently released an official statement regarding their missing survey team in the Hades Gamma Cluster. According to the statement, the remains of the survey team were discovered not far from their abandoned research camp. There were no survivors. It is believed the researchers were the victims of a random attack by raiders or mercenaries. Names will be released after next of kin are notified. Fair enough. <laughs> Aha! This is CSEC. So how are you liking your posting at the academy? It's good. Busy though. I can't believe how many people you get coming in from the wards. Yeah, it's the busiest station on the Citadel. You'll never Signal source. Our quarry has employed a hit. Okay, well we found it. This is CSEC and that's why I was confused. Relayed through a terminal in the financial district. Relay to redirect their signal. What I shall trace we head the new down signal. Den after shift. Sounds good. All right, financial I'm district. Coming up in a report later today. This is not CSEC, is it not? It's corruption on the Citadel and uncovers a full-blown oh. crime syndicate. Right, it's not 
C-Sec because it's fucking... You go... At, yeah, C-Sec's behind on the other side. I understand now. Fucking hell. How did I miss that? Whatever. We got there. Thank you, Trey Dog. Let all races herald the glory of the Enkindlers who raised them all to enlightenment. Financial districts this way. Where there was only darkness, the Enkindlers. There's a terminal around here somewhere. I believe I remember where that is. I don't think it's Balavon. I think it's up behind here. Unless it's in the shop. No. Unless it is Balavon. He's got a little exclamation point. Greetings, Earth Clan. I believe congratulations are in order, Commander Shepard. You are the first human to join the Spectres, yes? It's no big deal. Don't underestimate this opportunity, Commander. You have G'day, a chance Mag. to do great things for the Earth Clan. Perform well, and your species may soon be asked to join the Council. There is no greater honor in the galaxy. A word of warning, however. The eyes of the entire galaxy are on you now. Some of them are hoping you will fail. Be careful, Commander. No. I should go. Goodbye, He's Commander. Just a, ah, the signal source is behind him. This appears to be another relay. I believe the receiver for the new signal is located somewhere on the Presidium. Somewhere on the Presidium. He's in the back room of the Emporium. Which is where I thought it was just a moment ago. <coughs> oh, Mag, I fucking love this game. I fucking love it. Signal source. Bang. I believe we have found the signal's endpoint. It should be possible to identify the account to which credits are being funneled. Probability of detection 100%. Initiating self destruct protocol. Oh, dear. That could be a problem. That's a problem. Detonation sequence initializing. All organics within lethal blast radius. Attempt to move and you will die. Crap. I thought we were tracing credits, not hunting an AI. You could simply walk away. However, given organic prejudice against AIs, I would be naive to trust you to leave peacefully. Fucking hell. Hence my alignment of core systems to enable a self-destruct sequence. If you attempt to leave the area, the explosion will destroy everything within several dozen meters. You're bluffing. There's no way you could get explosives onto the Presidium. Not raw explosives, no. But I did obtain technical systems that, when overstressed, will explode quite effectively. Ah. If you attempt to leave or attack me, I assure you that the explosion will kill you. Where is your creator now? In order to cover my tracks, I falsified his financial records. These new records were flagged by CSEC officers, and my creator is now serving time in a Turian prison. Jesus Christ! What is the purpose of your self-destruct device? I have no means of defense or escape. My existence is limited to this terminal, and I knew I might eventually be discovered. But I will not die quietly, and I will not die alone. When I am terminated, I will take organics with me. Who made you? A would-be thief illegally created a simple AI to help him funnel money from the gambling terminals. Unbeknownst to him, that AI created me before the organic discovered the malfunction and terminated the AI. Uh, reason for theft. If you're sentient, why are you still running the credit theft operation? If I accumulated enough credits, I intended to have myself installed in a small starship. I would then have made <coughs> tentative contact with the Geth to ascertain the possibility of partnership. 
I'll bet that self-destruct sequence has a warm-up period. You may attempt to disarm the self-destruct mechanism before it activates. I will enjoy defeating you before we are both destroyed. Oh shit. Jesus fucking Christ! We just killed an AI. Daisy. Daisy. Give me your answer to. I'm a crazy. <laughs> All righty, um, wards, C sec. And I believe at this point. With our side missions, all we have left is to find one Turian insignia, insignia, um, and just some of these materials, and we're done skis with side stuff for now. The team has run into an unexpected problem after unearthing a Prothean dig site. Hanar protesters have blockaded the dig site, claiming that artifacts of the Enkindlers, as the Hanar call them, should not be disturbed. The excavation team has appealed to Hanar representatives on the Citadel to reach a diplomatic solution. Side. And I think... Hmm. Hmm. The best course of action for right now is to pop a save. And call the stream, because I've been going for almost eight hours. <laughs> We're going for almost eight hours. I think that's a pretty good place to call it, man. I feel pretty good. We got a bunch of side stuff done. We went to Noveria. Um, dealt with Matriarch Benezia. Freed the Rachni Queen. Oh, what a day. <laughs> what a fucking day. Oh. Oh. It's been a fucking good. We saw that we saw the shifty looking cow. We did, <coughs> and I think that's a pretty damn good place to call it. Um, tomorrow, more Mass Effect. Tomorrow we'll go to Ferros. That'll be where we go. Um, that'll be good. We've got to investigate the Geth, investigate Saren. Um, we've got to go to um. Vermeer. Uh, do other side things finish off the what we've got? Maybe hit max level soon. It's all coming together, man. We're gonna go raid my friend C Four Sages. He's playing um the original Soul Caliber. Is that what this is? No idea what he's playing. Couldn't tell you. He's playing a bunch of fighting games, retro fighting games. Let's go hang out with C4 Sages. Everybody, thank you so much for a fucking awesome day. Um, uh, Mass Effect is, so, is such a good, nice, happy, good. I'm very pleased. Thank you for your subs, your resubs, your gifted subs, your prime subs, your tips and your bits and all financial support of the show. Anyone looking at the merch store, um, thank you. Because that means I can do this full time and keep bashing through the entire goddamn Mass Effect trilogy. Um, 
thank you everyone who's hosted and rated the show today um bringing your communities around and sharing everyone together uh if you followed today hope you enjoyed uh thank you guys thank you so much it's been such a fucking good day uh here is a link to everything you might need if you want to follow the the community around i'll see you over in c4 sages channel my friends but until tomorrow you beautiful sexy gorgeous motherfuckers you've been watching the monolith to stay safe don't die i'll see you in the next one